I'll just be getting you guys the IP if you want to join. I'm also gonna be adding it in the description for you guys. In case again you wanna join. There's no worries because this round is almost Five, over, so we may as well, you know. Three, two, one. Okay, I think we're ready. Yeah, we wanna extend the current level. I love snow. Oh, I don't even know what's going on here. I like that it's like a prison. Um, this is not a good place to be in, for sure. The random crit. There we go, totally outskilled. Nobody melee fights me and gets away with it. There we go, nobody. It's like they're demonites, they have the advantage in all kinds of sins. And I still wreck them. I do not want to know of any of the videos you speak of making right there, so uh, hope you accept that and uh, just be dealing with these demo knights. Come on, melee me. Another random crit. Look, I'm just too good at this game. <laughs> I'm just too good at this game of melee fighting. I want to play in Dinia. That's why there's a sentry. Oh, if I don't have a pad. I have a pen, but I want to play in Dinier. Why can't I play in Dinier? Look, I have a, I have a strange pen of it. Okay, stop. I'm legit. Like until that, that sentry have killed one guy. One guy. Okay, I remove that sentry. Relax. It's down. The sentry's down. Relax. I mean. They don't want me to have a sentry. Well, I'm still gonna play engineer and I'm gonna melee fight these fuckers so hard. Like, they have all the advantage. You know what? Never mind. I'm not interested in, in melee fighting them. That, that, no. No. <laughs> they are using chance grids and I'm a cunt. <laughs> I'm an hit. <laughs> I'm not a tryhard, I legitimately am running engineer without a sentry. I mean, what's their problem? Go go melee fight. I'll I'll like try and Use this once, and then they complain. Yeah, I've been using melee. I I've got three kills. Three kills. Two of them are melee. I mean, what's the problem? Look at that. I'm just too good, as I said. I, I don't get why they have a problem. I got one kill with a sentry. They have... I don't even want to bother with that. You know what, this is why you can't play a proper game on community servers. First up, there are barely any maps available. Next up, you have to follow the damn rules. And even when you wreck them at their own game, look at that. Three of my four kills are with the wrench. And I'm the problem here? Okay, okay. Why be a demo pan when I can wreck them with a 1000 degree wrench? Look at that, I'm just too good at this. I'm just legitimately <laughs> too good at this shit. <laughs> I'm following their rules, as you guys can see. I don't... Can you leave me alone? I'm following... Oh. Oh. I suddenly get why somebody said that he was rare in chat now. Can you, like, do your own thing at least? I don't need a demo man following me.
I mean, legit. I mean, okay, one. I had one with the sentry, but that's not really my kill, is it? That's the sentry's kill. All of my kills have been with the wench. I, I don't get it. I mean, I had, I had four or five kills on the wrench. I'm just saying, four of my five kills on the wrench. Oh, people these days. Like seriously, I respect your rules. At least respect mine. <laughs> I mean, I got an assist on the gun kill. I didn't get the kill. And look, they aren't even following their own rules. It's like, that's a spy. I mean, or maybe that's one of my viewers joining. But I... Hey, hey, you guys. I don't want to be the scum of the earth. You can join and do whatever you want. Like, just do it. I want to see some good stuff here. I mean, that's not even, that, uh, that's not even, you know, a valid point. It's like, I I'll do demo pan the day I get a golden pan, and that will probably be very soon. So... I mean, until then, you'll have to deal with my wrench here, because that's my most expensive melee weapon, and I want to be using it. I don't know why I have a pocket medic, but uh... <laughs> I mean, a, a crit is still gonna, you know, crit, so even if I'm overheal, it doesn't really matter. I'm, I just wanna push him all. There we go. If I had gotten a crit there, I would feel so bad. But I just wanted to push him off. That scout is cheating, clearly. That scout is clearly cheating. It's like, I'm following their demo pan rules. I'm actually a worse, and... I, I don't get... Uh, it's like, I'm legit playing with a handicap here, and they're getting bot hurt over it, and I'm one of the reasons why they aren't... You know, doing like they, that, why they are salty. Like, what? I'm following their rules. I mean, the medic, and the, there's a spy, and then there's a scout, and there are multiple people who aren't following those rules, but I am following those rules. They shouldn't even start with that shit. I mean, li listen, following their rules. I don't get what their freaking problem have to be. It, there's no help. But I mean, I am following their rules, so I, I don't know. The scout isn't there. You go. I mean, almost had him, but hit the spy instead, I guess. I don't know. Felt like I should have gotten a crit there. It's like, okay, we go to the good keep. I'm still gonna be an engineer with my melee weapon because that's the only thing I've been using ever since they stated their rules. Or oh, whatever. Some people, I mean... It, it's 
just like nowadays you can't even play with a handicap. It's like if people complained when they were a soldier. Why am I, why are you playing engineer? I'm countering you. Play soldier or some shit. I don't know. That's kind of the same mentality that's going on. But um, I kind of want to break the rules and build a sentry. But uh, the other side I'm not. I'm just going to break the rules and the guys that are breaking the rules. Because I'm not going to fight a scout on a pyro like this. I mean, without a sentry, I can't really fight a scout at all, but I can maybe fight the pyro if, if there wasn't the spy, the pyro, and the scout there. But I really don't want a pocket medic. Like, seriously, that's, that's why they're salty on me, because I have a pocket medic that I ca I'm trying to, you know, here tell off, but... Uh, just can't win. And I kinda just wanna wreck that scout in either case. That was random crit. Oh, that's the spy. That's the pyro. Didn't I dominate him with melee? That's embarrassing. <laughs> you had to go pyro for that. <laughs> Revenge, that is. But um, seeing as nobody really plays that way anymore, I can safely go sentry again, right? Because clearly playing engineer is tryharding. I don't see how... It, like, in no context can playing engineer be a tryhard thing, because he's countered by everything that isn't trolling, pretty much. And, of course, scouts. But everything that isn't trolling and then scouts is the only... Like, everything that trolls and then scout is it's the only thing that doesn't counter engineer, but every other thing can probably pretty much counter engineer. Like, medic, <laughs> easy count on engineer. Either you have the Ubers, or you have the crossbow to take down his buildings. There's just no winning with it, with engineer. That's the, what is it called? That's the actual tryhard there, the guy who went scout, and uh, now he's a sniper. But no, I'm getting the blame for being the tryhard here, so, very well. I couldn't get that melee, if only I had gotten that melee. Oh, I mean I, I hit it, but I didn't get a crit, that's the issue there. What's betting on it? I just wanted to play on a snow map, like actual TF2. Then I tried to adapt to whatever they want. And that's still not good enough for them. I don't know. I'm not even gonna bother with that sentry right now. I kinda wanna flank that sniper. Sentry down. Oh, there he is. Yeah, he's just gonna play the chicken game like that, isn't he? Ain't nobody got time for that. Building the sentry. Okay, we we do know that there's a spy. Wanna be on the lookout for the sniper as well. I mean, I could just go snipe and snipe him, I could also go spy and backstab him. But where's the fun in that? It's always about the style of the kill, not so much that you get the kill. But, um, yeah, I mean, everybody knows that I'm the tryhard because not that guy dominating me, clearly. So, seeing as there is a spy and all this bullshit, I just kind of want to kill that sniper. I want to do it on his terms, so I'm going to play sniper. If I were dirtbag, I would just go spy, because then I have the advantage. But right now, he's going to have spies, and I'm going to be a sniper and try to out-snipe him. 
Okay, I guess I do have a medic on, and it may just be... Wait, where did he go? Where did he go? I think I lost track of him. Where did he go? Seriously. I, I somehow lost track of him. I don't know how I got backstabbed there. Wait. Oh shit. Okay, I'm done with this shit. I am just done with this. Oh, so we went back to Skull. Just when I switched off Engineer, that's... That's nice of him. So there is legitimately no way that I actually kill him as a spy when he's a scout. Because I have to be engineer or a scout for that. But, you know what, as I said, it's all about the style kill, so we are gonna go for that. We are so gonna go for style kill. Know that there's that spy around here. Okay, he's overhealed, this is not gonna go well, no matter how you put it. I'm just gonna go scout. I mean, he's still gonna have the upper hand because he have a pocket medic, so I'm gonna wreck him without a pocket medic, because... Then I still have the style with me, right? Is that, isn't that how it works? I'm just gonna wreck the, the medic first. Or not. Actually, I'm out of there because that's a reserve shooter pyro. Why are all these people lame? Why do all of these people have to play lame? I'm seriously. Why does it show a skull marker? Is that a new thing they did for the eternal reward or something? I have 10 this, I need to up my game. I didn't even get that because somebody else got a random crit, damn it. But no, I'll... Um. It's just funny that they are calling me a tryhard and then you see how much they try hard. It's like, what the fuck? I actually have to try and they have so many spies. Couldn't hit that. As everybody should know, I'm a very bad scout. Yeah, I don't even know why I have a medic still, as I said. I shouldn't have one, I'm not good enough for it. Are you kidding me? C can people, like, leave me alone here for a bit? I, I feel like I have to fight at least four people. On my own, most of the time, yeah, but... I don't know, I'm probably just bad, because if I were good, I could still kill them, because, let me be honest, they aren't even that good. Still want that revenge so badly, but that's blinding me and making me an easy kill a lot of the time. <sighs> ah! Why can I not? That's just embarrassing for me. Can I not get... Ugh. I'm I'm just done now. I'm done. I'm... I don't even want to bother anymore. I'm just... You know what? You want to play unfair? Yes? Okay, let's play unfair for you. Because... Wait, I'm just realizing. He's a scout and I'm a demo man. So he already have the advantage. Okay. You know what? We'll just... Always to... Like other people and not me. You know what? We'll just... Again... We're playing a very tryhardy class now. We're tryharding, even though I'm bad at this class for whatever reason I use by now. Um, but it's still a style kill because he's playing a scout, which is the counter to the class I'm playing, right? I hope that counts. Oh, he, he switched to, de uh, to soldier. Perfect. Now I'm actually gonna have a chance at this shit. Unless he does stats here. No, still gonna get the chance and the revenge. But I didn't really like get the kill, so kind of feel like I still need to prove myself. Why? Oh, I was gonna like 
think why he didn't go to like fire resistance and I ended up blowing my didn't even matter. I don't even know what I want to. I just you know what I just wanted to have a nice chill game and instead it's like I'm not even sure what I should play because I feel like every scenario where I fight anybody at all, I fight a bunch of people. I'm just gonna do that. And that's why am I engineer when he's a soldier? Why am I engineer when their tryhard is a soldier? What is wrong with me? No, no, we we have a medic on. Can't get away with. Can't get rid of this medic, no matter what. I, like no matter how much I try, so I may as well use it and go heavy. I don't know how he keep doing that. It's like, is it a front step or is he just behind me because he jumps above me? I th think I was looking up. I don't even know. Could have gone here. No, I can't. I suck at this game. If you ever wanted proof of how much I suck at this game, here you are. <sighs> Can you? Oh, that's not a spy. I'm done being nice. Oh, what your little indie bit? Oh, that's not the. I thought he was a gunsling engineer. I saw, just saw his face. Not this time. Like you've done that way too much now. Look, the one time I'm not looking at his direction, he can't backstab me for whatever reason that I do not know. They want to try hard. Here they go. That's how you try hard when you have a medic on. You just go heavy, and then I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. Like, that's the least tryhard thing you can do with the Medigon that's going heavy. At least in my opinion. Man, 15 deaths. I, I really should have just not bothered with their rules and whatnot. I respected their rules for way too long. You can feel free to join. The, there's a, like IP in the description. You can also join off my profile on Steam. There should also be a Steam link in the description of this like stream. So, should be up. Like, easy to join, so you can feel free to join. Oh yeah, I remember now. They wanted the good keep, so that I could play engineer still with my melee and wreck their face. As I did for so long. I don't get their logic, but very well. Like, they wanted to, like, if, if you're just joining up and, like, seeing what's going on, they played Demo Knights and they complained that I was wrecking them with an Engineer wins when I'm literally having a handicap. Uh, logic, you know. Uh, it's like, why? Why? I assume they wanted me to go Demo Knight here, but... I don't care about playing with a handicap, as I did before as well. Process is actually a terrible map, but whatever. And by that I mean, I hate 5 TP maps in general. Well, that's the only reason why it's a terrible map. We have the spy there. He's not gonna be ambassadoring us, so it should be very easy. We should have the melee chance against him. Okay. That's B, I believe. We have lost control point. Ah, dead ringer. <laughs> okay, I got wrecked for once, but I know I dominated him by melee fighting him, so at least I've got that on him. Just need to up my game. 
Don't know why those weren't connecting like that. Okay, that's a bit too low HP for me. Oh yeah, the the HP is over here. Am I the only one seeing the funny thing in this? They're bot hurt over nobody being melee because I didn't know about their rules and build a sentry and got a kill with it. They tell me the rules, I go melee engineer, they keep complaining, they move to this map and then still like one of those people that complain are playing Huntsman Sniper now because they only want to play melee. Some people are just never happy, no matter what you do. Like, uh, am I seriously the only one seeing the irony in this? Okay, that was a scout up in my face. I should have reacted to that, but I didn't die at least, so... Come on, spy! Oh, shit! Again, with the arrows. So it's like you want a melee fight, but you're still gonna move to a melee only map where you can still use crossbow and bow and then you're gonna use bow isn't that cheating like you some people the logic oh shit that was a spy they're like surrounding me here <laughs> and I still get crossbow that's four people going for me there and probably the sniper too That's what you get for respecting other people's rules. I heard the hit sound there for sure. Why did... never mind. But hey, uh, listen guys, I... Uh, I don't sell my power and use your like... I sold the pyromancers. Le let me just show for a moment w while not being crossbow shot by the guy who wanted everybody to play melee. But, um. Where's my pyro? I have, what is it called, an reorbiting fire pyromancers mask that I picked up uh, a while ago. I made a video. And then very recently I managed to pay 120 keys pure for this smoking pyromancers, even though it's only like 60. So I sold my old reorbiting fire pyromancers. And um, then the, what is it called, the um, the Wraith Trap, the Smoking Wraith Trap is uh, the one that I'm promising away for the art contest right now. So whoever wins my art contest is gonna get that. Can you not be tryhard? Like, can this guy not be a tryhard for once? I don't know. That was a long range crit. Oh, he's, he's, I get it now, he's playing with the, the Criticola. So we have a scout that's gonna be in our face. We have a medic that seems to this. Like, they just have more people, and all of those people wanna beat my ass up for playing melee in Dinia against their demo pants. Where I'm severely handicapped, and they're gonna be. Again, I don't get their freaking logic, tell me. Somebody in chat, tell me the, their logic. Tell me their logic for treating me this way. Because I don't see it. I just don't see their logic. For being assholes right now. Okay, you know what? They want a demo pen. I know this is like severely upgrade to what I'm running now, but I can see a thing where I can do exactly whatever these but her idiots warned, and then they don't want it anymore because ooh, now it's suddenly that's a problem, right? Let me see. Because now I can charge up and hit that sniper in the face. And it, the the one crit misses, and the ing flow makes so that you have two HP left. 
No, 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 because before we run like a s snow version of Batwater. Like just before we run a snow version of Batwater. And they wanted everybody to play Demo Pan, but I wanted to play Engineer. And then they tell me the rules, and then I, I just start meleeing them. And I get like, I think it's four melee kills. And they get butthurt over me not playing Demo Pan. And it's just, what's the logic in that? I'm legitimately, I don't, I don't have charge, I don't have secure crit. I'm basically handicapped compared to them. And it's still a big problem for some reason. Could have done that way better. So that's why I don't get their logic. It do just doesn't make sense to me, but... I mean, I guess the logic is that... Engineers OP in melee, because I can get beyond that logic. I mean, you saw how good I am at me melee engineer. I don't get why he's sounding. I don't know if... And like, look at that! Oh, fine. Oh, yeah, they did road process, so... I mean, I can I can probably one-on-one, -on -one, but when there's always gonna be a crossbow medic, a huntsman sniper, and then whoever I'm melee fighting against me, no matter what, unless I go for, like, the sniper or the medic, where it's like, then it's gonna be the sniper and the medic versus me, no matter what there, then I don't know what to do. They just had people who actually wanted to try and I don't want to try and nobody on my team wanted to try even when I joined the map at first when they called me a try hard and melee fighting as an engineer I don't want to try I just want to have fun <laughs> oh <laughs> somebody just burned everybody uh, like yeah because this is this is head fortress too it's all about the heads and uh, that, that's the best joke you made there with, with the red team's inventories Well, Pillow, why do you have to taunt? I mean, you killed me, I noticed you. You don't need to taunt. And besides, you, the sniper, and whoever I'm melee fighting is on me. I, I mean, that's an unfair fight. I mean, kill me in melee one-on-one. -on -one, and I'm just gonna be scared of you, because now we're on a serious map, and if you're doing that with a medic, I'm legit gonna be scarred. So, th that's a challenge for you. I, I don't like want to try to sound like an ass, I'm just trying to be funny, but I don't think it's funny to be playing an unfair... Oh, we're going back to the... Oh, yes, I want this map. This is such... I love snow maps. I don't know why. I just love snow maps. I mean, beat me in one-on-one. -on -one. It's fine, but don't taunt. Like, don't be an ass. It's like... The control point is being contested. It's like... I, I don't know. I, I don't mind that you're taunting, but all I'm thinking is, well, there's an ass. And also that Jack Carver is always on my ass, so I mean, I don't know what to do about that. But, um... He's a tryhard, and I'm actually gonna try now, and I'm gonna play a bad class, but I'm still gonna try. Like, no matter what I play, I'm gonna try. And the idea here is that I wanna reflect kill him. It's like, why does all the classes that I'm actually any good at have to be the bad classes in the game? I don't know. I don't know. But, I'm gonna deal with that soldier. Nope. Yeah, you can join via my profile. Why do I have to... Fuck everything up here. I didn't want to die to the melee, but then I died to the rocket instead. So, um, Pillow, uh, now that I know you are listening here, uh, you and uh, that Yakava guy are always on me. I would appreciate if, if you could wait until I've killed him and then you kill me and then you taunt, if you have to. But let me just kill this Yakava guy first and I'll be happy. There you go, now you can kill me. I'm all yours. Take me, take me. Kill me. Kill me. I, I killed him, you can kill me if you want. I, I don't know the delay, but, but kill me, kill me, kill me, kill me. Yeah, there you go, perfect, there you go, thank you. That's how you do it. 
That's how you do it. You let me kill the idiot first and then you kill me. And then you taunt. You did it. Yeah, I'm going crazy as you you guys can tell, but um okay, let's let's kill that soldier some more now. Ah. Uh. He looked up, but then he shoots down. Didn't make sense to me. A am I the only one seeing that there because <laughs> Looking up, so I'm assuming he's shooting up, and then I think I can just charge him, but then I get hit by a rocket. Is he using virtual reality or something? I don't know. I honestly don't know what's going on there. I just know that you can technically do that with virtual reality. Because then you can technically have your camera looking up while your actual aim being down on the ground. So maybe I shouldn't try and... This is just annoying. I mean, I could go soldier or demo and wreck his ass, but it's basically if uh, if I have this tooth with pillow now that he can kill me after I've killed the jerk, or at least he can try to kill me. But oh shit! You wanna fight? Oh, no. No? Okay. Choose? Okay. Look, that's respect. You have to respect those people even though they humiliate you. you you've just... you've lost that fight. You've just lost that fight when, when you are at this stage. Okay. Have to negotiate with people who wanna kill you just so you can get to kill their tryhard. Like what? I don't... I think this pyro was aggressive, so I took care of him. But now, where's that? I don't actually know if that pyro was uh, a spy. Not scout. Look, I've lost it. I've lost it. I can't even see cloud. I don't know who's who's gonna kill me anymore, but as soon as I let my guard down, I bet I'm gonna die. Okay, that's... Okay, we found one guy who's an enemy. You know what, this is why I usually just kill everybody I see, because... You don't know if they're gonna kill you. Did... No, he's still here, but where is he? Where's he at? Where's that Jack guy at? I wanna... I wanna kill him. And I want to actually, mm, you know, air blast kill him. I don't want to actually just take a cheap kill on him. But I just don't know where he is. I don't know what this pyro is doing. Okay. Is that actually Jack? Oh, it was. I don't know what I did, but it seems like Pillow lost all interest in fighting me. I guess it's because I basically gave up already. I mean, it, I get it. It's like... But I just really want to kill that guy who seems to be the jerk. And that's the... What am I doing? And that's the whole story. And, like, after I've killed... Like, in the fight where it's like... I don't... Know, yeah, okay. I, I don't... I don't... Like, if he attacks me, I'm gonna fight him, else I'm not gonna fight him anymore, because he's gonna team up and then kill me or some shit. I don't wanna anger him. I don't wanna... We've already won, and I don't wanna restart that fight, and... 7 HP. Oh, I should've dragged out the pistol earlier.
That's a long respawn time. And they are gonna cap right. Okay, that's true stair, I guess, and um Oh, never mind, that wasn't an aggressive spy, I just thought he was. And I can't hit my meat shots on that guy. He's clearly a better scout than me because Aside from me being a bad scout, he seems to hit his meat shots. And the only classes I'm good at is Engineer, Spy, and maybe Pyro. And even so, they are <laughs> not good classes. So I don't know why I even... Like, I just like to try and take a... Did you sap stuff? I don't like that. That is... Okay, so I got two crits there in a row. I think that's fate, just saying, you know what? Here you go. You, you've admitted that you're worse than this guy. Now you can officially get to beat him. I, I don't know. Again, I don't know with this spy if he's an enemy or not. Look, fate is with me now. It's like as soon as you admit your flaws, fate is with you. I don't know what's going on. Maybe it's just because I've just given up on anything and even trying and I'm just directly following my gut feeling and then somehow I can actually hit my stuff. Like a lot of the time, I've realized that if I try and kill people or try and do stuff too hard, I just do it worse. And uh, my aiming is basically my gut feeling. Like I follow my gut feeling, I don't really go so much in skill as that per se thing. It's just... I follow my god when I try and aim. And that seems to be distracted if you are trying too hard or if you are trying to get revenge. And that's why I always have such a hard time either taking revenge or focusing on I don't know if this medic wanna fight. And I got distracted there. It's so confusing. It's so easier when you can just, you know, kill everybody and you don't have to respect some kind of shit, but then again, you can't get to kill that jerk, so. That's the thing. Like, this spy is clearly friendly, so it's just, like, in the state that I am at now, I just don't want to make enemies because I have a guy who's seriously trying and he's good with the classes he play, which seems to be <laughs> all the annoying classes that I don't play or... I'm good with at all. Okay. That was a Tuesday. I almost attacked him. That would have been totally devastating because, you know. So. Can I hit? Nope. I couldn't hit at all there. Point is being contested. Oh, what's going on there? Is that spy trying some funny shit? To be honest, like, if I have to be realistic here, I think I have a better chance at killing Jack Carver's scout if I go engineer and just use the pistol than I do if I go scout and try and scattergun meat shot him. I mean, I don't even need to build a sin. Okay, yeah, that's. was just checking with that pyro if it was. Never mind. I was checking with that pyro if he was uh, aggressive or if he was just, you know. I should have just killed him. You see, this is why you need to kill everybody, because else you get distracted, and then their tryhard kills you. Like, look at my team. Nobody is really wanting to kill people. They're just having fun. So, if I start making enemies, I have to fight all of them. Oh, okay, that's below. Yep. I thought you were Jack for a second there, but should have just played properly. So... So that's, that's basically, they have, it, I mean, Pillow isn't really fighting, so they have two people who are fighting. They have the Pyro, and then they have the, the, their scout or whatever, you know, their top score, or their tryhard. And on my team, there's me, but I'm not really trying that much, and I wanna, I wanna, you know, I wanna have that right feeling. I don't wanna play something that I think is unfair, I want to have the right feeling. It's like, if you kill somebody, it have to be the right feeling, it's, like... 
got to be with the right class and it have to most of the time be without a random crit but sometimes those random crits feels just right i don't know it's it's just that feeling you you need to be at a chance where you either severely outskill outplay or you have the disadvantage against the guy you you beat that's that's the kind of mentality i have when i try and beat somebody hi just replying to a hi comment in the chat there Can we play like, can we like all play properly this time? And, you know, I, I want to play properly because now we're on the snow map and we've had fun. A lot of people don't really do anything, but I'm at least going to play properly now. I think that's what we're going to do. And I don't know if, if that Jack guy is just mad because was he the guy? Like, I, I can't look back, but wasn't he the guy? We're mad up. Can I look in the chat and like see because? No, but that pyro was. And I'm a tryhard because they didn't tell me the rules and I got one kill with a sentry and then I destroyed the sentry. Wait, I don't. I'm getting confused so. Is Jack Carver one of my viewers who just want to kill me because he think it's fun? Or is he one of the demo pants who got mad at me because I honestly can't tell anymore? I just know there was a lot of hypocrisy going around here in general. Mission begins in 30 seconds. Yeah, I'm preparing for a fight. You, you could also, you know, join the team who lacks people, but... That's not fun, I guess. We do need more people in general. Mission begins in 10 seconds. Why do we have two engineers and nothing else? I mean, <laughs> we only have two players, so that's that. I know I'm wasting like 70 metal there, but whatever. Didn't want to stay around the sentry. Okay, I don't even know what happened there. Did somebody explain? <laughs> like, the scout didn't want to die to me, so he ran into another sentry or something. I don't know. Uh, nothing much is up. We just have had, like, I've had a very, very weird day where people have been hypocrite and uh, I, I don't even know what to tell you. Calling me a tryhard for only melee fighting as an engineer, as an example. So, I mean, you know people don't know what they're talking about. If you're calling them a tryhard for meleeing as an engineer and wanting them to switch to demo, like... Basically want them to play uh, to play something that's way better than what you are playing Just doesn't make sense to me uh, The most effective class in any given situation is the soldier. He's the most versatile He's actually pretty OP as well like in my opinion because he doesn't really have a counter at all Should have switched to melee there, but you wrecked me pillow very well even though you're playing the well, demo is like in terms of effectivity, demo man is the strongest, but he have a counter. Soldier's the most versatile and doesn't have a counter, which is in direct contrast with like TF2 thing. So basically, if if I'm serious and I want to try hard, even though I'm not bad at it, I go demo man. You can call it rage demo, but that's basically what I do because demo man is such a broken class and does so much damage that it's legitimately stupid. But Soldier is the most OP one because he doesn't have a counter in a class-based shooter, which the whole concept of that is just stupid. Like, seriously. Did 
didn't kill Pillow there. I wanna kill Pillow now. Like, both of us trying. I wanna kill him. Just melee killed me. It's embarrassing. He should have taunted. Pillow, you should have taunted. Missed opportunity there. Uh, sniper doesn't count as soldier, and I can tell it very easily. You know how soldier got the ability called rocket jumping, which makes him able to move at a very fast speed and also be very unpredictable with air strafing. Yes, that makes it so that sniper can clearly easily shoot him. But no, honestly, what that makes is that it gives sniper a harder time shooting him, ending in close the distance to the sniper, and then he two shots the sniper. In any given situation, also soldier have a uh, what is it called? He have a hump on his back, so he's actually harder to shoot when he turns around than other classes. He is way better equipped at dealing with like not being sniped than a lot of other classes are. Snipers only counter, and this is a specific situation. Or snipe one of snipers counters actually another sniper, and that's a specific situation. But the other counter would be a spy. So a sniper is countered by, as an example in, in this case, countered by other snipers and a spy. But soldier, you can look at it and being like, okay, a good counter to soldier would be soldier, but soldier is not even countered by himself. That's just an equal matchup. But in the case of like sniper on sniper, he is just countered. It's just funny like that. It's a bit hard to explain. Also, I won't be able to like stream the next, I think, 14 days or something. <laughs> Paying you back, pillow. I know it's a humiliation, but uh, well, he can still strafe while dropping down with gravity, and he can strafe around corners. I don't know. And uh, yeah, there are sadly only nine people watching. I wish there were more, but you know, I can't really change that at all. Uh, my channel is strictly to TF2 at the moment, and I intend to keep it that way, but, you know, you, you can't predict the future, but I'm, like, heavily invested, so unless, like, TF2 closes down, there's no way that I'll stop playing it a lot, because, <laughs> you know, my collection, it's like, you kind of have to play the game, right? Still have the feeling that Valve is somehow gonna kill off the TF2, like, whole thing with an update at some point, but... If they really like, if they really pull themselves together and deliver a good update with the Pyro update, it's gonna be good. What do you mean with like 24 hour live raffles again? Oh, oh, yeah, I may actually do that. I get what you mean now. I may do that, but right now I don't really have stuff to give away, and I am holding that competition, like art competition. So, I mean... Like, if I get popular enough, people can start expecting unusual, give, like, 24-hour uh, raffles on my streams. I mean, seriously. Especially if I start setting up donations and whatnot. But as it is right now, no, I don't, I don't know. I'll probably... That, that'll probably be an unusual raffle at some point. Um, right now, Pops, uh, like, if you go up in casual, most of the time, for me, because I'm a good player, I get put on a worse team and I have to carry them, which means that I have to play my main or I have to play soldier on demo, and even then, because my main is a bad class, like, overall just a bad class, and especially the way I play him is, uh, you know, giving myself a handicap, uh, it's not really fair when I play casual in that sense, so I don't know. I tend to always be the best, best player on my team and the enemy a lot of the time have three players around my skill and they're just kicking my ass, but I mean, what can you do? I wish it would just go back to where it's a bit more casual because that's the style I like. I'm never really tryharding, I'm always playing it chill, I'm just playing for fun, I don't really try unless I, you know, go raid demo, sometimes that happens, but... You know, and even then I'm so bad at demo that you can hardly call it even trying, so... Even though I'm trying. Like, get it, get it like this way. I'm always trying, but the ways I play are more creative and not optim optimal.
Yeah, the old casual pops. Everybody were more chill. A lot of random shit happened, and um, even the tryhards weren't even trying that much. I mean, they were trying to play their best while not really, you know, trying to maybe win, or they were just trying to have fun. They were trying the best to have fun, and I think that's the best description of what I'm doing right now. I'm just trying my best to have fun when I play. I'm not tryharding. That's the thing I'll, I'll say there. I think that's the best description for me, yeah. I don't know if you guys get me when I say that. Or in that way. So, as I was saying a bit earlier, yeah, I'm, I'm probably not gonna be able to stream for the next 14 days because, to put it lightly, my parents have to do some stuff and they asked me if I could take care of their house and the dog and then I was like, yeah, sure, and they have pretty crappy internet and I doubt I can stream from that. And uh, that's gonna be like 14 days, so that's gonna be a while until the next stream and that's why I wanted to do a stream today so you guys have a stream to watch. I mean, may even do two streams today, like, now I've mentioned in this, and then the next focus of the next stream is that I'm not gonna be streaming for 14 days, so. Yeah. Oh, they have a sentry. They are, they are actually, like, trying, okay. Um, another thing is that, like, if you're tryharding, you don't really care how bad your enemies are. Like, to put it lightly, it's like if your enemy, like if the enemy team have, let's say, everybody have like one score and they have one good guy, then you don't care. You're just gonna like brutally pop something and not even like you know take it chill. That's a way of tryharding. But if you like, you're giving them a bit of a chance. You're not really trying your fullest. Then I think you're just playing for the fun of it, even though they are not that good. It's just very hard to go over, like, what people define as a tryhard. But strictly speaking, I'm a tryhard because I always try to play my best. Even if it's not optimal and even if I give others a chance. So to put it lightly, yes, I'm always a tryhard, but I'm not an unfair tryhard. I, I like to give people a chance. I like to watch stuff happen, to say the least of that. I like also to be like very deep with specification of stuff as you guys can hear. It's like trying to define a try hard and then going very deep into it. Oh shit! They're just, you know, they are they are just trying to seriously camp our base. Okay, that's gone. Speaking of tryhards, I really hate demo mans, like, and soldiers in general, and even more because they counter engineer. Uh, I don't feel like I'll ever get bored of TF2, but everybody says that, so the word isn't there. The only word I can give you is how invested I am in the game with all my unusual weapons and whatnot. Pillow, I just lost all respect for you. You died to a sentry with a direct hit. Just seeing the direct hit alone make me lose all respect for you. You don't need a direct hit to fuck up an engineer, you just make his day and himself feel like shit by doing that, and that's just brutal. That is how you define a tryhard in my book. Aside from, you know, trying. Then going for direct hit and all of the lame shit, that's just not okay. That's an unfair tryhard for me. Like you're legit playing my counter and you play direct hit. Just saying. I'm just saying that I don't agree with that. I mean, by all means, do whatever you want, but I won't respect you for the direct hit. But I mean, you never asked for my respect anyway, so go ahead, have fun. I mean, that's all that matters, right? That you have fun, like that... Le le legit, I'm not, even, I'm not even being sarcastic here. What matters the most is that you, yourself, have fun, and then everybody else have fun after. 
or everybody you care about, and then everybody else can have their own fun and make it themselves. But that's not your problem. That seems like an interesting map. Again, I like to be very deep with stuff. I don't know why, it's just part of my personality. Oh shit, that's a, that's a one hit kill. Like if, if the direct hit hits me directly, then I'm just dead. I took some splash there, somehow, but I didn't die as a result. I want some crits. <laughs> okay, okay. Who's gonna bet that pillow is gonna kill me within the next like few minutes and then I lose all my crits without being able to use them and he does it by one-shotting me. I live in Denmark. Like I have to agree with this guy. Capture the flap maps are just terribly designed because you have to basically spawn camp people to cap their intel. It's one of those definitions of being unfair. It's like, you don't win really unless you're on the unfair team. Why did I miss that shit? There we go. We have secured the enemy intelligence. Oh, random crit. Oh shit. I mean, I almost predicted that thing with Pillow. I almost got killed by him, but I respect that he took out his melee and tried to fight me that way, but I don't know. I mean, I had the crits secure anyway, so it wouldn't have mattered with the damage output. Like with the mini crits, that is. I'm already done with all my education and stuff. I mean, aside from- <laughs> Oh my god, Willow, did you just do that shit? Oh, good shit. Oh, you- Oh, I wanted you to blow up there, somebody killed you. Oh, I- I- I just... I- I- I have to respect that you dragged out your melee, but, um, I almost had you. If I hadn't had to reload my pistol, because I forgot to reload my pistol there, then I could have hit you, but then it's like I fucked that whole thing up, and then you see it, you take the chance, and that's just well played, man. That's well played, that's respect plays right there. That's beating somebody with style. I mean, that's that's something I always respect on people, if, if they beat you with style. It's it's not how they beat you, or how many... T or it's not how many times they beat you, it's how they beat you. And that's just something I value a lot. Like, anybody can kill somebody with a direct hit, but can you, like, make a last stitch comeback and just take out your melee, which is, like, do or die, and then run up in their face with the increased speed and then just get a random crit on top of everything else and just nail them down on the ground? That style. Like, uh... Speaking of uh, the education, like, I don't, I don't really care, like, I'm done with my education, so I couldn't really care much about education systems. I'm happy with how my education went, and I'm just happy it's over, so, yeah. Wait, so I can say I don't know your name or, or what, because that's your name, so, and uh, hey to the new person in chat, I assume. This map is really loading for a while. Yeah, that that's the point. That your in-game name is I don't know, and then I'm like, I don't know your name. Because it, it, it would be like, you know, I don't know. I have plenty of stories, especially if I get to like get into it, but it's hard to start on a story, so if you guys want to like ha have any questions that could lead to a story, then I'll be open to answer those.
like you can ask into anything like my already like I've been telling like a lot of my stories are already on video and you can find them everywhere but I don't mind retelling them so if you have like some questions that basically you're too lazy to like find that video on your own and you just wanna hear kind of a story in regards to your question then feel free to ask them I don't know this map at all. Why am I playing against engineer when I don't know the map? <laughs> I don't know. Let's, um, we can't switch class here. Okay, we're playing engineer it seems. <laughs> yeah, it took forever for me to download too. Also, another thing, like, speaking of tryhard as I was before, right now I can't fit my, find my sentry, but oh, that was. Um, speaking of tryhard as I was talking about before, just the fact that I'm recording or streaming makes it so that I'm not a tryhard because it's actually hard. Like, it, it's like a handicap to be streaming or, you know, doing videos because you're recording and you're, you're trying to multitask. Just the fact that you're multitasking makes both things harder. And I'm pretty sure... Anybody who's like doing videos can tell you that it's much harder trying to do what you do while trying to entertain and like keep talking and stuff. Oh shit, I got backstabbed. Like, you, you're trying to split your focus and then you're not good at both of them, so... That's another fun thing, just as a side note. But that's also why if, if you really focus, you can't talk. You, a lot of people will stop talking and try and like... Let's say I, I'm fi trying to kill a guy real badly, then... You may have noticed that I just completely shut off all communication and go full on I have to kill this guy now mode So that's where the guy came from before Well that's the health and that's the ammo Oh shit he have a ambassador, he just needs to body shot me now I think I outplayed him, but I'm not sure. But he just needed to body shot me after he got that headshot. That's the so, like, the very scary thing about fighting an ambassador. If they get, like, a random headshot on you, you they can just body shot you and you're dead. Hey to a uh, newcomer in chat. And by newcomer, I mean you, you just started watching, I assume. Come on. And he got the face sidestep something. It's like I went to the one side I, I thought he was going at, and then he he straight goes straight instead, and then he steps me from the side or something. I don't know. I shouldn't fall for those, to be honest. I should. The the right move there, whenever a spy, you know, a spy is being tricky, is to sidestep them. You go backwards and to the side, and then they can't backstep you. Is that their spawn? No. Can you not? That's two spies. He just needs to body shot me now, and I'm dead. But he failed it again. I'm just better. Uh, they have three spies, guys. They have three. I, I played around the two spies very well. You guys saw that. But, who would have predicted the three spies? I need to up my game. That's a spy, isn't it? No, that's actually a scout. I don't even know what's going on on this map. Man, I'm quit, but of course they have a bunch of dead wingers. Still got him. So that was their third spy, so now I just need to play around the two other spies. Again! Always my sentry is being sapped, it can't even do shit because I have three spies. It's just, that's the annoying part of being an engineer, especially an aggressive engineer. You wanna leave your sentry. 
but you can't because it's always gonna be sap before it does anything. I wanna go around being aggressive, but that just doesn't work. I think he dead wingered. Pretty sure he dead wingered. It's like I don't wanna take care of my sentry, so I put a disposable down and then that's it. The, the headshot there. Kinda hoped he wouldn't have landed it, but whatever. It's hard when they have so many spies, as I said. I didn't actually kill him there. Oh. So yeah, he's just headshotting people. It's surprising that he haven't been headshotting me more than just once before, to be honest. So, they have... How many spies again? There's two that that way, and then there was one here. And like, you can have too many spies to the point where it's like, not even good, and that's what's annoying about it. I could switch Pyro right now, and they wouldn't even have a chance. <laughs> Fun metal, yeah, gun metal was the best. They get like unusual weapons became a thing. That was just the best. What the fuck is going on here? Oh, I like this map suddenly. I get what's going on and I like it. So both sides have to get the card here where it then gets like it flies back. Oh shit. Then it flies back and it like opens the, the route for it to be complete. That's actually nice. Oh, fun metal is still a good word to call it because it was fun. Oh, that's abusive. Damn it. Look, look, I'm busy on one of their sniper, uh, sni I mean spipers, spipers, and then I get headshot by another one. You just can't win. So we'll go pyro now, because they. I, I want to show how bad that many spies are when one just go. You know pyro. I didn't even need to do anything skillful there because everybody went in a panic. Okay. I mean, Pyro is actually very bad against spies who can, for one, headshot you, and number two, use the revolver. Um, you don't need to check. You can uh, walk over the ammo box, and if you get ammo or metal as an engineer, you know he dead wingered. So it's not really that hard at all to check. And besides, if I click tab all the time, it just doesn't make for fluid gameplay. It just doesn't. And as soon as... Look, that's two. There are two of them. There are two... Uh, and then a soldier too. But there, there's two spies who are trying to ambassador me. I, I'm not sure how to handle that. But yeah, basically it's very annoying. Another thing I could do is check my uh, stat clock. Like, on my, you know, super expensive weapons, and if it goes one up, I killed the spy. And uh, the thing about the scoreboard, then I need to keep in mind how many kills I have at all times, and I need to consistently click the scoreboard, and that ruins the video. And since I like to do videos, and you know, like, you, you may have noticed how much I actually check on, in general, like, uh, on the stream as an example how much I check the scoreboard, but whenever you see my gameplay videos, it's very rare that you ever see the scoreboard, just because I, I, I do that for, like, professionalism. I usually check the scoreboard when I'm dead only. Well, the thing is that that map was rather open, so a pyro was the bad move to go for. I don't actually know how to deal with... Like, that's the reason why Ambassador is being nerfed. They're not doing it the right way, though, but that's the reason why Ambassador is getting nerfed, what happened there, that... If you have enough ambassador spies, they can just go around headshotting you. You can chase one down, they backpedal, and then the other one will headshot you instead. 
and then in addition they can escape. So it's like it's snipers, but you are never in danger because you can always set wing and escape. That's the reason why they are nerfing the ambassador, but I do not agree with the way they are doing it, of course. Guess I wanna be blue this time. Let's join the tryhard. Oh shit. It's a flipped map. Well, this is gonna be fun. Well, it seems like I didn't join the tryhard team even though I went blue. Okay. Whatever. It's one of those wacky maps. I have made a video with some of these, but not this one. I would have loved to do it with this one, actually. What is it called? Badwater Tilt, okay. Oh, I wanna play Engineer here. I wanna see if I can find some abusive places to place my sentry now. Like, you can do it like this on walls, but you can't actually do it on the standard ground outside. Isn't it funny how I actually went uh, pyro to try and counter the spies and then I realized I had a better time when I was engineer because then I could bait them close to the sentry to sap it and if they didn't they couldn't ambassador me. So if they were close I could get the melee off on them and then outplay them. So by playing engineer I'm actually countering ambassador spies more than if I try and play their counter which is pyro. Because they have the dead winger, they have the spy signal and they only use the ambassador if there isn't the sentry to take down. Just think for that for a moment. That's why it was going so well when I played Engineer against them, even though they had so many Ambassador Spies. But as soon as they had the upper hand, then it's like I kill one of them, and then I, I can't do shit, because there's so many. You, you seriously can't go up there. He's still Ambassador Spy, okay. Oh, they're all up there, cheeky bastards. Oh shit. It's so hard to get where the spies are coming from on this map. So hard to do anything I guess. But... This is where you can get some interesting sentry like locations. Like... Oh shit. That's direct hit. Why? I... Why direct hit? I can't even get up here. Whoa shit. Why do people have to use the direct hit? I mean, seriously. Faster tower? What the fuck? Oh, it's pillow again. Great. Can't even enjoy funny maps anymore. Man, this is... This is so hard to move around on. I, I legitimately can't go this way unless I go up here. Oh my lord. Can I... Oh my god! Oh, this is what I call fun. We, we just can't grab the ammo box for... Whatever reason, we can't grab the damn ammo box unless we do this, I guess. Are you kidding me? It's so hard to navigate this map. It's actually hard. Well, if you subbed, I hope you enjoy the content, because else there's no reason to sub. I mean, the only issue with that sentry spot is that it's... In a sideline, where they can easily kill it. Oh yes, this is what we needed. But like, I don't know what you want me to say to you subbed. Like, if you have something you want me to say, I can say that. Like, oh thank you for subbing or something. I, I don't know what people do to those. But... The only thing I usually say is, well, if you sub, I hope you enjoy the content, because else there's no reason to sub. Tend to be pretty chill with stuff like that. I don't know if that's the right call. Ah, great. <laughs> oh, that's funny that you found out about me because of my advertisement. Was it the spray? Because, I mean, that's the only advertisement that comes to mind.
Who cares about Overwatch, Grandmaster? To be honest, I don't even care about Overwatch. The game is already ruined to me. It's a long story that I don't want to talk about because I... Again, headshot by an ambassador. Seriously, give me a break. Can you not? Can you not? And I get the wrong guy. Why do I keep getting stuck? At least I got him. Man, Raz, I know you're one of my viewers. Can you stop being a little bitch and play that way? Come on, have some fun with the others. Like, why, why do you headshot me? Do you hate me that much that you want to headshot me and be, a, be a, a, an annoying, you know, spy? Because, I mean, I, I'll take it personally. I'll take it directly personally now. Oh, yeah, I, I posted a bit on YouTube's comment section a while back, but it, it was mostly because, like, I, I kind of wanted people to be directed in the sense that, well, don't wait for Musilk to upload more TF2 content because he's clearly an Overwatch YouTuber now, or at least he's shifting that way. So why not find another guy that you can watch, basically? That was the logic behind that. So you don't, basically, so you don't waste your time, to put it lightly. There's so many soldiers on this map, why? Can't people have fun? Why do you have to play soldier? I mean, yes, if you want a rocket jump, but... <laughs> that was fun. Oh yeah, get outplayed, Raz. You should have taken my advice, you should have stayed spy, you should have stayed spy, man. That's what you get for listening to me. You get wrecked. <laughs> uh, sorry, I, I'm just trying to be funny. It's nothing personal. I just, you know, I'm trying to make jokes. Want to make sure you know that. It's just because it was so like funny in a way that that you actually do what I say and then somehow I'm punishing you for it. I don't know. Seemed funny for me. Makes me happy that you say that I'm good at advertising. But the thing is, like, a lot of YouTubers get a lot of subs by, you know, putting it in their name. Like, if I put my subs or just YouTuber in my name, I would probably get a lot more subs. But I feel like, no, I, I'm, I'm worth more than that. I'm not, like, I'm not, like, my self-worth is more, more worth than that or so. Don't know if you guys get what I mean, but... Like, I, I'm above that. I'm above that, basically. I know I'm thinking a bit highly of myself when I say that, but I, I just feel like it's a low blow, even though nobody else probably thinks that. To put it in your name. It's, it's basically making... It's like you call... It, it's like making your viewers a number. It's like... I don't know if, if you're getting where I'm going at, but it's like... Making your viewers into that's what you're worth and not yourself what you're worth It's like they shouldn't even be part of your little dick measuring com competition or whatever At least that's my opinion on it And then I get backstepped again Man, this map is so hard to walk on You should have built a teleporter back there Yeah, I'm, I'm advertising that in, in a sense, but if you just advertise by changing your name, so every time you do anything you're advertising, then I'm just like, no, that's lame. That, why would you do that? You aren't respecting yourself or your viewers if you do that, according to me at least. What? This map, I... Ah, uh, this is so hard to navigate on. Man, you have a very long name, like... Spams the chat every time you talk. Well, for me it's a big deal. And if it's a big deal for me, I'm not gonna do it. Uh, like, at least that's what I've made up my mind with. It would probably make me super popular or some shit, but uh, you can join the server. There's an IP in the description, and I got backstabbed again. 
was too busy reading chat. There's an IP in the description, and you can also go to my Steam community profile and join me from there, I guess. No, 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 no. Damn it. I should have hit him one more time. You failed. Yeah, and that's why I don't want to do it. I'm I'm one of those guys that I don't know. I don't like making enemies, so to say. I kind of just want to entertain people, make them happy, and um a reason why I stopped posting a new self videos, as an example, is that people were giving me hate for it. They were like, oh, boo, boo, boo. and then I changed it to just be like, hey, you know what, you should just find another YouTuber instead of, you know, complaining to MuseSelk. And it wasn't for his, like, Overwatch viewers, it was for people who were lacking TF2 content. But it's like, well, people got angry at it suddenly, and then I wanted to stop doing it. And then I stopped doing it, even though, you know... It made a lot of people happy, but it also made some angry, so I didn't want to do it. So that's why I've toned down my advertisement in that sense. And when I say some people, I mean one or two guys who, who posted every time I posted my thing. Like, even though I actually put time into it. Um, no, what I did was basically telling people that they should find another YouTube like most of them were basically telling people that uh, stop you know giving you a hard time just find another TF2 YouTuber basically somewhere in that regard and then I kind of guess I hinted at myself making videos and that's the advertisement in that sense so it's basically there were so many butthurt people way back when Musil said that he was still gonna do TF2 frequently, but basically uploaded once a month. Even though he, he didn't say anything about stopping with TF2. And then I just decided, you know what, why not leave a, a helpful little, you know, hint hint. And that's what I did on some of his videos back then. Did I just see like a cart fly there? Well, I just think he should say that he's done with TF2 and don't want to do it anymore. And then people can realize and start finding another channel. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. So, not only is the card super fast, because it's faster tower, it's also higher tower. I don't think uh, Overwatch is fun. I think it's very re repetitive. There's no room for actually relaxing. You have to try hard and like work as a team. Always. That's the game. If you like that kind of thing, it's probably your kind of game, but it's not my kind of game. Oh shit! <laughs> Apparently you can get driven down by the cards. <laughs> I, d I actually thought I would be pushed by the card and not be killed, just saying. Did I almost get market gardened? Come on, fight like a man. Hello, seriously. I was trying to melee fight you there, and you still kinda, you know, tied it up with your freaking one shot directed.
Building a sentry. <laughs> yeah, how to push cat if it kills you? Maybe one by the, its side instead of being in front of it, like this. Oh, oh shit! No, <laughs> there's no way to push that card. <laughs> oh my god! I actually, I didn't expect that. I was pushing it from behind this time. Wait, is where salt's using that? Okay, so let me get this straight. There's two people now who are watching my channel and want to kill me, and both of them are using direct hit. How can you be that lame? Okay. You wanna be lame? Sometimes TF2 unequips your items. You wanna be lame? Let's be lame. Let's be lame. No matter what I pick, no matter what I do, I can't do anything because there are two soldiers with direct hit. So I may as well go demo man and try and outplay them. I mean, they directly want to start a war with me here. They want to fight me, and they both want to, you know, kill me. So I may as well... Ziggy spam them. <laughs> I don't know if it was actually done on purpose, because this is also higher tower. It's called faster tower, and somehow people can still push it, even though it kind of kills people. Never mind that. Oh shit, I almost got killed there. <laughs> oh, he just uh, he, he just plummeted there. Uh, I'm not actually a streamer, you know. I'm, I'm a YouTuber, but I also stream, so... Um, no, but it, it's funny because it's like, Oh, you like this person, why not help him? No, you wanna, you wanna team up and be on fan, be like, Yes, I killed a YouTuber! And it's like, so what? Uh, do you feel better about yourself now? I mean... Well, you made me feel terrible, so I hope that makes you happy. That's the kind of thing. Like, I'm, I'm trying to be nice to everybody, but... Happy to ha make you happier then, I guess. Because... If killing me made you happier, then... I mean, I, I, I don't want to be a psychologist and tell you that you have serious issues, but... Um, happy to make you feel happier nonetheless. Yeah, I know, I remember your name. Like, I, I, I don't know exactly when you joined, but I know you've been here for a long time because I remember that uh, Seat name, like, the first of your name. Like, deep in my memory of uh, this person I've commented a lot. Upward Abandoned sounds funny. No, but I just mean... Like, I get... Like, the reason why I'm not just playing on casual as well. Like, I would play casual right now, but people want to play with me, and uh, what they actually want to say with that is, they either want to, you know, pocket medic me, or be, like, help me, or they want to focus me, so it's like five versus one. And if I wasn't okay with that, why would I stream on, like, so people could join me? The short answer is, I wouldn't, but right now there are two direct hit soldiers. The bane of my existence, mind you, soldier and direct hit, the two things I probably hate the most, aside from sticky spamming, in the game. Or oh, actually, I hate that more, but the thing that is actually the strongest, and my most hated weapon, is the sticky spammer here, but... It just makes me annoying that, uh, annoyed that people want to, like, hate me that badly. But I mean, still outplayed. Look at that! I didn't even look! I outplayed them both there! I just have to actually try with a class that I'm not good at, but still one of the best classes in the game, and then I have a chance. Can people stop? Like, seriously. I mean, okay. I, I get it. You want to kill me. Can you take turns at least? At least give me a chance here and take turns instead of, <laughs> you know... I I'm having a... <laughs> Listen, am I the only one seeing the fun in this? I'm having a guy trying to market garden me at all times. And then... I'm having two direct hitters, but now I guess one of them went spy, so there's that. 
I'm happy that I have a pocket medic right now because that actually gives me a chance here. Oh, there we go. What do you feel about that pillow? Can we get some salt in the chat? Like, for, for me being angry at the direct hit and then being a hypocrite for using the sticky bomb launcher. Oh, that would have been a nice air shot there. Or an air sticky detonation. <laughs> yeah, I'm a sticky pa spammy cunt right now. And I'm being salty, I'm such a hypocrite. But mind you, this salt is from when I tried to actually just have fun. And now, right now I'm a tryhard with a class that I'm bad at. But I'm still, like, this is... Like, going demo man, stock demo, is when I think I'm having the best chance at, like, being strong. Because stock demo is silly as fuck. Um, actually, demo man can take a lot of skill and he can not take any skill. The way I play demo takes no skill, as you can see. But if I had skill, the demo would be totally OP and broken. And OP. But since I'm not good with demo, then everybody can pretty much play demo this good that I am, but, you know. That's why I go rage demo when I go rage. But, uh, Soli doesn't take any skill unless we talk about uh, the rocket jumps, because... Or, or I guess the direct hit, but it's like... It's, it, it's the same with demo, as soon as you have the skill for the direct hit, you just... Like, it's just silly how stupid you are. It's like you one-shot most classes, they, they don't even stand a chance. You do a little rocket jump to get up close, and then you one-shot them. It's like, what the fuck can they do about that? An engineer, a scout, it's like they're gonna die in one shot. Um, I'm... <laughs> well, I know you're joking, but seriously, I'm good with engineer, spy, and pyro. Basically, the three worst classes in the game. <laughs> so, I mean, I wouldn't even call myself good with them. I'm just decent at best, but, you know... I'm a terrible demo, I'm a terrible scout, but I still go demo when I'm like, okay, I seriously want to kill these guys because I want to show them how stupid this class is. Hello to new viewer that just started watching, I guess. Man, my voice, I can just feel, like, every time I stream, I feel like I'm butchering my voice. I'm talking way more than I need to. And I always get into these salty situations where I talk about some shit I hate of. Mostly because my viewers want to torment me with direct hits and whatnot. Just because they know how much I hate direct hits. But, uh, I mean, <laughs> you're having your laugh. I respect that. I don't respect you for using direct hit, though. I mean, seriously. But you're having your laugh. I can respect that at least. And um, that's why we are not playing on commu. Uh, or that's why we are playing on community servers, so you guys can focus me or whatnot. And then I look like a little bitch that I am and a bad player that I am. So fair enough. It still makes me annoying because everybody who actually watches the stream doesn't get the enjoyment. So you're literally sucking all the enjoyment out of the stream for your own you know, selfish nature of trying to kill me, but if that's how you want to play, then fine. Uh, Beggar's Bazooka is just stupid up close. It's like you can kill a heavy instant. I know it's just a game, but I'm trying to run a stream here, and if I'm dead all the time and people are taunting and being rude, it, it's like that's rude to the stream, everybody watching. I don't know, Th that's what I'm thinking about. That's why I'm getting a bit salty. Oh, this is abandoned upward, actually. Like, I'm trying to, you know, entertain some people, and I can't, like... Actually, 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 if you guys are making me salty, that entertains people, doesn't it? Because I think a lot of people are being entertained about how salty I am. But I'm just saying that if I'm spending most of the stream being, stream being focused by two directed soldiers and I don't actually get to play, and that's also why I go demo man, then it's not entertaining to watch. It's like. Would you watch a guy who's just dead all the time and looks very bad? The reason why people enjoy watching my gameplay mo or gameplays as an example is that I'm not bad at the game, but I'm not good either. But I'm good enough to actually be entertaining to watch. But if people are just focusing me and being a bitch, then I'm not entertaining to watch. And then you ruin the stream. And then that makes me mad because you ruin some other people's entertainment and other people's happiness. And the thing that matters for me is that people are happy. So that's just all. 
Like, I hope you understand that at least. Like, you can kill me all you want, but it just ruins the screen, sadly. Like, there, there's a reason why if I get focused in a, in a casual game, focused enough, I just scrap the video because nobody wants to see me spend the whole video dead or being dominated by, you know, a group of friends that signed up like maybe three or six people or it's like a, an actual comp team because I've met that and then they start focusing me. I mean, I don't want to make videos of that because that isn't fun to watch me being totally smashed down by a pre-made comp team. I, I, that's the like I hope you understand like that's why I'm being a bit mad or salty That's the only reason because you're ruining for a lot of other people who are trying to watch the stream. I Don't know. I mean my voice is starting to die now. I can feel I Just took my own sentry's bullets there or rocket. I mean It's funny when I'm trying to save the sentry, and instead I kill the spy, but whenever I try and kill the spy, I actually, you know, repair the sentry instead. Because there I was trying to save the sentry, but I killed the spy as a result. And hey to the new viewer in chat, or, you know, we, new, newcomer to the stream, I guess is the right word. You just missed all the salt in the world, and you'd probably enjoy it. I even had to go demo to keep the stream interesting because I was dying so much to direct hits. So, the real good thing about, like, you know, attacking a spy that just sapped your sentry is that he can't deadwinger if he just used the sapper. There's like a little period of time where he can't deadwinger. Oh shit. <laughs> I'm on a 10 killing spree now. Who would have known? You just need to take a serious talk about the enjoyment of other people, you know, watching the stream to your viewers who are trying to bully you, and then they respect you, and you can get to go back and chill and just have fun and entertain people while they still try and kill you, but in a more respectable manner, like with the spies. Basically, the root spy storm right now. It's basically the root spy storm. Did you actually die? I need to check. Yeah, he died. I got ammo, so as you can see, he died. While I do appreciate to like join your server as, as you're saying, then I don't know. I just, you know, like going with the flow and I don't feel like actually joining somebody's specific server because they ask me. But I don't know, I probably should, but... I mean, if I had my own server or were admin on a server, I would probably play on that with viewers, but that's not the case. I kind of like how this is such a big open room on this map now. It's usually like blocked off, but that seems amazing to me. No, that's not, but I saw a spy over here behind. By the way, this is a terrible sentry location because snipers can snipe it. Um, by the way, <laughs> I, I guess, I guess, but maybe another time. So, you guys remember before when all the ambassador spies were there. Now, I'm actually on a team that, you know, helps. Because a lot of the other times, the team haven't been doing anything. And I've just been bullied by a lot of tryhards. But now everybody is like playing on the team I'm on as well. And now those spies never have a chance because I'm an engineer. They have to sap my sentry before they can try and kill me. And as a result, they're just getting wrecked because I also have team backup. Isn't that interesting? You're all right, Doc. Is it just me thinking that's interesting? I can be chill because my team is also doing stuff and I'm not just being like the only guy trying to do stuff and then being bullied. By direct hits of all things as well. 
I don't know. Damn it, why do we why did we leave this map? It was such a great map because it's like a, a reskin of another map that's an actual map. Actually I really like the, the standard TF2 maps, especially the ones I've selected. Why do we have me open it three taps? Are you trying to become like three viewers at once? I don't think it works that way. <clears throat> I'm serious. I feel like I've legit like taken a grinder of sorts and just grinded my voice. Oh, this hurts. Every time I stream and get a bit salty, this happens, I guess. <laughs> it, it actually does. Wow, I don't know. We're back at Faster Tower. Why? Now we're gonna have the five soldiers tryharding on me again, aren't we? Whatever. Bring it on. I'm gonna go demo if you do, though. But until then, I'm gonna be playing Engineer. Because I'm Engineer, as the Engineer would say. In casual and comp. There we have a soldier. Get off my tower. This is my tower now. Damn it. I mean, it's a good tip to, to get off the tower or get off the payloads or not push the payloads because they apparently kill you. And this is like crazy payloads. It's like you have to walk beside it. Look at that shit. I just touched it. That's like a race car. Hi below. I respect that you wanted to melee fight me. I respect people who does that. It's like you want to melee fight people. I take out my melee and try and melee fight you. I respect that. Oh shit! I'm being sniped at. Are the tryhards really back? Like at least pillow isn't direct hitting me anymore. But but I mean, there's a sniper going for me, and I don't know. At least Raz is on my team. No wait, Raz, why did you betray my team? Now you're gonna try hard on me too. Great. Bring it on. The thing is, like, barely anybody else is trying on my team, so... Wait, where's win and cap? Where's, you know what, I just lost all respect for you. You're like, one of the worst human beings you capped on higher tower. Like, legit high, oh, well, faster tower, because this is... And then you backstab me in humiliation and taunted. Man, you're such a terrible person, you know. <laughs> Did that just happen? Did that just happen? I didn't expect the car to fly so far forward. Don't even touch the card, it's a good tip. I don't even know what I wanna play. Kinda wanna play engineer still. Random crit pillow, really? Really? I thought I was being like, ah, I'm a ninja near spy, and then I wanted to get the random crit backstab on you. But, um, again, we are on one of those maps where my team doesn't really try at all. And a lot of blue people are trying to focus me. Unlike the uh, upward before where both teams was actually trying. So it wasn't that much of a big deal that people was trying to focus me. No one from me. We were having a melee fight here. You, you better fight me. Oh shit. And there we go with the ambassador again. And I can't really build a sentry here because everybody is friendly. And uh, the old blue team is gonna focus on my sentry, so it goes down, but I'll try, I'll try. And then let's see if he can still ambassador me. That's the thing, you saw how easy it was for me when I had a bit of backup from my team and people were actually trying on both sides. But then, Pillow, seriously, I had 28 HP there, just needed to melee me, and then Rares of course comes and clean up, because you have to be a party pooper again. Who, who even cares about Overwatch? You, you're gonna join me and, and gonna be on the stream, right? Come on. Nah, the best the best weapon in the game is uh, Sticky Bomb Launcher. 
Hey, Raz. Can you stop being a little, you know... I almost also had him. I mean, I heard some of my melees hit, but... This is the thing, like, I walk out of spawn, and Raz is just there camping, which ruins the stream in a bit, because... I don't think this is so entertaining to watch for some people. Like, yes, I have to deal with you and Pillow in every game, unless my team actually cares, because you are... Trying to spawn camp me here. Look, and now he's dominating me. It's like. Seriously, dude. You don't want people to enjoy the stream, clearly, because you're spawn camping me and there are other people focusing me on a map where people are just trying to chill. I'm not even trying, but. I mean, seriously. Give me a break. And by that, I don't mean break me. Did you actually just die there to the pyro? Again, the only reason I'm a bit mad is because it, it, it's ruining it for viewers of the stream that I'm not playing. It's the same with like, back with that Jack guy where I asked if Pillow could back off for a bit because I just wanted to kill the tryhard because it kind of ruins the stream if the streamer is the only one playing on his team and the enemy team have at least two people who are focusing you with better classes and countering you. Going up. I guess Spike qualifies as a counter for engineer, doesn't he? I mean, I respect people who like... Like in this case, Pillow, if, if you just see me just killing Raz, you, you can feel free to kill me, I won't mind. But at least let me have this, because Raz doesn't seem to want to back off. Like he doesn't seem to want to back off, he just want to be a jerk. The only reason, like the previous map, what was it, uh, abandoned upward was good, was because I actually were on, like, a team who played. And, um... Then I could actually do stuff and didn't have to fight four people on my own or whatever. I didn't kill him, I got on a revenge even though I. Like again with a headshot. Okay, great. We know you can use the ambassador and headshot me. Can you play another class now or what? Actually, keep playing Spy, because as long as my sentry's up, I have a chance. Holy fuck, how did I get five sentry- six sentry kills there, or whatever. I know one of them was probably a dead winger. <laughs> yeah, fuck me, apparently. Yeah, now I'm the tryhard. We have become the tryhard. Another Spy, I think. Did he die? I'm checking. He died, okay, good. But yeah, there we have another Spy. So... I appreciate that you respect, like, the stream pillow and actually back off while other people are focusing me. Uh, I, I don't mind if you're focusing me and nobody else is, but it's like, as long as, as my team aren't doing anything and I'm the only one doing stuff and then I'm being focused by multiple people, it's just not entertaining at all for anybody, I think. Other than the guy who's trying to kill me, he's having a lot of fun, but everybody else and everybody watching the stream, I, I don't mind honestly, I would just, if this were a video, I would just scrap it, because I hate when a lot of people are just focusing me, it, 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 it isn't entertaining to watch. It's like, oh he's the YouTuber, let's focus him. Everybody's seen that. Unless I actually do something nice in most of the game, but it's like, if, if you're spending most of the game dead anyways, why bother? And thank you for liking my videos, that means a lot to me when people say that. So right now there are two spies on me, and that's about it I think, because Pillow is backing off a bit. So I just need to deal with two spies before I can actually, you know, even see people are not even playing. And there you go with, again, this has happened, what, five times the last few minutes where I walk out of spawn, I'm in a small corridor so it's easy to land the ambassador headshot, they headshot me and then either make a body shot or knife me. And all my team are friendlies and relaxing, which is the problem. Like, it's not really a problem, it's a problem because people are focusing me, and that's the only reason. 
It's like there's legit two spies spawn camping me most of the time here. And I don't think that's funny for anybody. I'm sorry, Pillow. I'm sorry, Pillow. Uh, you had your back turned. I just feel like going for that. I know I'm an ass. You're probably gonna focus me. I don't blame you. Join the fray. Come on. I feel so bad right now. I'm, I, I became the tryhard even though I'm engineer and not really a good class. So. I don't know. You saw the other spy. And um, you killed me about three times near my spawn before I could get out of spawn. And you sapped my sentry. So, I mean, you, don't, you probably don't know, but there have been like this guy on your team that is rare. So even though I joined the team he is on, he's still going for me. You know, the red team's top score right now. And you've been up my ass for I don't know how long. Like, sin like for a lot of the stream and just focusing me. And then when other people are also, you know, killing me. It's just not fair, and the only reason like people are killing me probably now as well as another thing is that I'm the only. Uh, no, you. I think you've killed me once. No, no not one. You, you killed me twice at least. Like outside my spawn. I'm not sure exactly, but I know you've been going for me at least. I know I at least killed you a few times because of it. <laughs> Look, you're totally spawn camping. The only person on blue I think that are actually playing is me so if you're playing the game and not being a friendly you're going for me that's the logic there clearly ah uh, I'm I, I don't know man I don't know hey pillow oh oh okay that explains it I mean, can we just have some fun? Um, you can join me, the IP is in the description. You can also join off my profile. I just wanna see if people are, like, I wanna see who's the, the jerks right now. If I get killed while being friendly, we know who the jerk is. Sorry. So I'm not even gonna try right now, I'm just gonna check who's a jerk. That's all. So this is basically, like, let me get this straight, all of blue, like, everybody on blue aren't really trying. Okay, I, I was trying to escape that sentry there without going out of the tone. So, let me put this straight, everybody on blue isn't trying. <laughs> You're such a jerk pillow, you know that? I don't blame you though, because I did that random quit because it was tempting on your back before, but, you know. But, thing is, that um, all of my team are actually respecting high tower rules and just being friendly. And that makes it so that if I'm not friendly as well, I'm being focused. So now I'm just checking if I'm friendly, who's gonna kill me. I know this is very tempting for you. I'm... You asked for that pillow, just a payback, just a payback. <laughs> okay, I'm out of there. Okay, let me see. Oh shit, I made war. I made war, run for it! <laughs> I'm not having any of that war. Okay. I think Raz chilled down a bit, so at least there's that. But now nothing is happening, nobody's doing anything. And it's boring, because Blue doesn't wanna fight. And if I fight, I make war with the whole, you know, team of Red. <laughs> oh, that was... I, I was body blocked in there. Uh, I don't accept friend requests on Steam, sorry. You have to join the Steam group. I use that as kind of a way to communicate with my viewers and stuff. So it's like that. That's kind of my friend list. 
Because else that's like, if you can tell me why you want to add me and have me on your friend list, then I'm listening. But if you can't and it's just, oh, because it's nice to have a YouTuber there, then why would I? That, that's like, try and look it from my side. That's why I don't like... You just steal my wrench. Did you just steal my wrench? Oh shit, I made war. I made war. I've made war. Rass is never gonna forgive me now. If you poke a try or a, a, a war, <laughs> war. I made war. But if if you poke a guy who's actually focusing you when you finally made friends with him, then you you are b settled bad. Like he's he's never gonna forgive me now. He's never gonna forgive me now. Oh shit. Run for it. Run for it. No, I, I mean, so, sorry, but if you can tell me why I should add you, go ahead. If not, then I don't see the reason. You can join my Steam group and that's basically my YouTube friend list. The thing is, a friend list have a space limit. So it also makes it more confusing the more friends you have. So that's just a downside for me to add everybody who asks because there's like about 2,000 people who want to add me just because I do YouTube and I don't have that many friend spots. So I hope you can understand that. Oh shit, yeah, I made war, I made war. Okay, one-on-one -on -one rares, are you up for it? Just, <laughs> I mean, I know you are. I just hope nobody else, like the only problem I have with Rares here is that he's going on me when everybody else is as well. <laughs> sorry, I don't, I, I, I don't know why I killed you, sorry that. <laughs> puns, puns. Oh, yeah, okay, we, we are. We are melee fighting. We are melee fighting now. We, we, we are not tryharding, we're just melee fighting people now. That's our game. We are melee fighting everybody. We are melee fighting everybody! Everybody's gonna melee fight the engineer. We are melee fighter now. We're not tryharding, we are melee fighter. We're we meleeing? I don't know. I mean, legit, you can go heavy and melee fight me and you have a better chance. Or scout, I guess, but... Then you have to abuse the attack speed and move speed. <clears throat> that, that's the two on one thing that I was talking about a bit earlier where it's like, I, I don't have a chance if they play it right. But it was fun trying at least, if, if only. <laughs> Rip demo. Oh, never mind, I think it charged somewhere. But le that's like the thing I to talked about a bit earlier. If I make war, I have to fight multiple people. Because I have to fight rares if I'm not friendly. That's like a fact. Then we have Retrugo, however you, you pronounce that, which I made war with again. So he's gonna be, be trying to kill me, which is acceptable. And then we have Pillow, who's also gonna be trying to kill me, as well as everybody else I try to kill. Again, I don't know why I killed you. I'm, I'm seeing a guy and... Uh, I don't know. I, I just see a guy who's doing stuff and then I'm like, ooh, that's a melee kill. I'm a boss at melee fighting the... Hey, hey, Raz, at least, like, respect the melee. Respect the melee. I'm only meleeing people right now. Can you at least respect that if you want to kill me? You can go any class and melee me and I'm respecting that. I guess pistol is okay, so you've got that at least, so... I'm not gonna say anything to that, but... I mean, I can't. Pistol is my favorite weapon. Why, why would I be hating on that? Respect for that, even though I meleeed. Uh, you can join this uh, IP in the description. Like I'm melee fighter. I don't care. <laughs> I I'll take everybody on. Come on, 12 versus 1. I'm melee fighting. I'm melee fighting. Come on, melee fight me. I want a melee fight. Want a melee fight? <laughs> That's karma. That's karma. <laughs> I'm trying to like make sure that everybody wanna melee fight. Uh, 
Um, you add it to favorites on TF2 and then it should pop up in your favorite list. You can also go to my profile and join off it there. I, I said melee fight, not shotgun with that soul and he, he stole my wrench. I mean the soul didn't hit me but it was distracting that a soul was trying to shotgun me when we are when I've called melee fight. Damn it. A again, that's like <laughs> two people behind me. That that's the thing where it's like unless my team start fighting as well, I just have no chance because my team, even though I ask for melee fight, they are at the top of the tower being friendly. So again we we go back to that circle that I complained about that it makes the stream stream uninteresting that I have to melee fight everybody on web team on my own at once. I mean one on one, one on one is okay. Like one at a time is okay. But you can see, like the the amount of people, and I even got ambassador headshot there. And there's a sentry too. I asked for melee fight, and you you get that. Twelve people versus one, and they have a sentry and an ambassador just because they're too afraid to fight an engineer with a melee. I mean, seriously, I'm an engineer with a melee. You you two shot me with a melee. It's like what the fuck? F fight me! I'm I'm not even. Building a sentry, I'm not being a douche, I just want a melee fight. And you have to not respect me. What the fuck is that? Like look at that, I I try and fight a spy and then we have two people on me again. Where it's like two... Can you wait until I'm done with the melee fight and then kill me off? Because at that time I probably only have 10 HP and you can one shot me. Like that's the thing, I like I go for the pyro now and um, you look at that, you look at that, <laughs> you, you, am I the only one? No wait, this is because I'm bad, I'm bad at the game, look at that, it's nothing to do with my team not wanting to fight, this is what I've been talking about the whole stream, the team I'm on never want to fight but the whole enemy team want to fight me. So now that I call melee if I don't say that it's okay, they can't even, you know, one versus one, like take a turn, draw a ticket, so now it ruins the stream that I spent the whole stream dead because they're spawn camping me here. It's like I can't even, I can't even, like I hit one guy, I needed to hit him one more, I hit the other guy, I need to hit him one more. And then, you know, I, I don't get why this is entertaining for people that are on the enemy team. Like why do you have to ruin my stream of all things? I get that you hate me and want to ruin me, but why do you have it to ruin it for everybody watching the stream? Like, I can't even, like, I have to kill the first guy that's camping the spawn. I have to kill the first guy in melee combat, or it just doesn't work. And they also have spies, so I actually have to always kill the spies first, or I die. Do you wanna fight? Yeah, you, never mind. He doesn't wanna fight, apparently. I don't know. Like, great, I got dominated because I melee fighted 12 people at once. It just feels bad. Got the revenge at least. I don't know if that... That's the thing, I called melee fight and I expect everybody to want a melee fight. So when they don't, like now I have a melee gun and all the... I said melee fight. Why does this guy have to use a rocket launcher when... It's like I'm legit the least threatening thing in the game. I'm an engineer meleeing people. Why is that a threat for people? I I appreciate that Pillow is actually healing me now because now the stream is interesting even though I'm being a cheap, you know, son of a bitch, but whatever. At least the stream is interesting. But it's like why not just, you know, take the melee fight? I'm an engineer, you're a soldier. You I need to hit you two times even if I crit. You just need to hit me two times in general or once if you crit. The least threatening thing ever. Come on. <laughs> oh, that was that was funny in a way. Oh boy. Nothing protects you from a side face stab or whatever. 
At least that was a bit more fun, that life, wasn't it? It's like, I, I got some thing things going for me, at least. <laughs> yeah, the red card is having a panic attack. But again, I'm, I'm really the only guy on my team who are... Wait, that guy doesn't want to fight, okay. The problem there is that, okay, at least he respects it, but it's like, I was fighting the spy and then there are two other people who want to fight me. And then Raz, of course, charges me and kills me, even though I were having the fight with the other guy. That, that's just the problem here. It's just, I, I don't even want a pocket medic, I just want people to help me melee fight. I don't even know if that spy wanna trick stab me or actually. Okay, now we fight. Okay, okay, yeah. Why the why the ambassador shot? Why the ambassador shot? That's not nice. Why? Why are people? I just beat on you. Damn it! Got butter knifed. At least there's some respect now that it's like, okay, somebody intercepts our fight, I'll let them fight it out and then... But the thing is, like, look at that, I, I won two melee fights in a row, and then, of course, I die because I'm a bit low on HP, but... God, that was a face step. Seriously, that was a face step. That was a face step. That was like that was such a face step. I wasn't even close. In range, that was like a five meter face step. And we have a mini sentry up. I mean well what? That was a face step. I wasn't even in front of you or behind you. Like, <laughs> I was like so far away. That ringer. And, um, bad idea to tunnel vision. It's like right now I just want to kill you because you are dominating me. But then, I mean, it's nice that you respect when everybody else want to also fight me. But it's like I want to have that fight first. And then I can fight everybody else, but... And my team is still mostly friendly, which is the problem, right? I don't know, actually, but... Oh, yes! No! No, I wanted that kill! I won! Melee fight. Melee fight. I mean, it's a bit unfair that I have a medic on, so... I would love if he tried to at least, you know, trickstab me here. Ah, <laughs> oh, this is getting annoying. Well, when else am I gonna kill you? I have to fight three other people and because you're the only polite person right now other than, you know, the pillow that changed team to help me out by pocketing me even though I'd rather have he help me melee fight people, then, um, you know, it's hard to get you killed when I have to fight everybody else first. I don't know how you do that shit. I don't know how you do that shit, but I need to play around it somehow. Oh, I have too many deaths. I don't know. The thing is, I would say that melee fighting is over, but then my whole team is still not gonna melee fight. And that guy's still gonna be mini centering it up. I had that! That was even a random crit! That was even a random crit! I had that! Oh boy. 
Just had to suicide even though we were laughing. Whatever, I still got the random crit. Fate wanted me to get that kill. You didn't. Uh. Oh, Red is capping as well. Okay. They didn't even get the revenge star. I I'm also having those reactions. Like, if you see on the stream, I'm dragging out the pistol every now and then. And that's just reaction. So I get the ambassador reaction, but you still shot with the ambassador. I'm yet to shoot with. Can you, like, not huntsman? I'm trying to melee this sniper, but he just want a huntsman. There we go. That's how we fight. That would probably have backstabbed me. I'm not even kidding. That would have been a, another face step there if, if I hadn't been... Like you could see the animation for the back step there as well. Damn it! I was even turning around, like turning with him there, but... That's usually how you avoid the trick steps. So, as you can see, that's basically all the people we are melee fighting, like... Uh, I, I, I guess two versus three because I had a pocket medic on. But again, I would still appreciate if I had help with the melee fighting. Because that's really the annoying part here, is that I'm melee fighting, but I have to melee fight, like, at least one versus four. And then, the, there's the gunsling engineer and the huntsman, and there's nobody helping me in the melee fight. Like, in terms of killing. And I'm playing an engineer of all people, like, I have 125 HP. Like, I'm so easy to fight with, if people just want to play fair. But no, it's it's the spice with the face steps, and you know what? It's like, ah. Uh. Like, why can't we split it up? It's like all the good players go on the opposite team of me. It's like, why? Like, I try Ryan joined their team, as an example. Like, wait a bit, because the map loads. And then I join the team where I see those people on. And they switch side, because then they can kill me, and nobody on my team is gonna do stuff, because they're friendly. I'm from Denmark, and you can play with me. There's a IP in the description, you can also find my profile in the description, and you can go to my profile and join the game that I'm in with that, like, join... There's an option to join the game, you know. Another's profile. But I never got that revenge kill there, which makes me a bit sad because it was annoying how I never got to actually be able to fight you for that revenge because either you suicided because you were laughing or somebody else intercepted while I'm trying to fight you, I get backstabbed or you face stab me or it's just annoying. It's like, I'm gonna try and see if this works out and just join blue now and then hopefully you see Raz joined the other team because he wanna focus me. That's an example of what I was trying to show. So, there's nothing I can do to make this stream interesting by joining a team with people who are trying, as an example. So it's always gonna be everybody who wanna try go on the opposing team. And then I have to fight them all. Which is fun. I can't even go pyro because they're gonna be ambassador spies, so I have to play in Denier, but then they're... Ugh. It's hard. I don't... Why can we... The control point is being captured. That's my official opinion on that map now. Great! We're going there again! So I'm gonna deal... You know what? I'm, I'm... I have a plan now, and I'm gonna do that plan, because fuck all of you focus guys. I'm serious, I'm done with you, you bullshit now. I'm, I'm sorry to be mad, but this is not an interesting stream. It's not an interesting... Ah, oh, can I... Uh. I'm lacking as well, very hard here for some reason, like frame rate drops and whatnot. But it's like... I don't... Can somebody tell me what I do if my team doesn't wanna... Or most of my team doesn't wanna fight, but the whole enemy team wanna fight me? 
Oh well, they just want to fight, but as my whole team doesn't want to fight, then it's like, what what do I do? Because I don't know. I mean, now that I have Pillow helping me, at least that's something, but other than that, I don't know. Like, even here I have to melee fight two people at once. And it's like, I, I don't know. And all blue, again, look at this! That's what I'm saying! Yeah, I wanna leave, but this is my viewers mostly, so it's gonna happen unless I go to community servers. All my viewers on blue, the team that I'm on. Unless, like, Pillow, because he, he's cool. You wanna help me, but everybody else doesn't give a fuck. They are on my team, they wanna relax, but whole red team wanna fight. And because I'm the only one fighting, I have to fight them all on my own with Pillow here. Healing me, even though I'd appreciate if he actually, you know, helped me fight them or some shit. But it's like... Oh, we, we're getting some help now. We, we've got another warrior to help us here with the engineer. The only time I actually had fun was on, uh, or where the stream was interesting, probably, was on the abandoned, whatever it was, like, abandoned payload thing. Where, uh, abandoned upward, there we are. Because there everybody was actually just playing, and it was fun. Like, stuff happened. I outplayed everybody focusing me because I had enough help, but... I don't know, it's just annoying. Like, why do the stream have to suffer because people wanna focus me? At least join my team. It's like, can some of those people who, who like, wanna fight, like, um, see it, you, you wanted to fight, why don't you join my team so you can help against the people who wanna fight me? It's like, if you don't mind who you fight and you don't actually wanna focus me, join my team instead and help. Yeah, but I mean, when you've got it fixed, not, like, if you... We join or something, I don't know. It's like, why do you have to be on the opposite team of me when you can just be on my team and fight the people who wanna kill me? Isn't that the solution? Oh, well, I guess, but on the previous map, on higher tower or faster tower, you were on the enemy team. So it's just, can we split up the team so there's a little group of reds who are friendly with the little group of blues, like here, I guess. And then, what the fuck was that sound? And then, we have the people fighting out here. Because that makes sense, doesn't it? Like, people wanna fight, they fight each other. People wanna be friendly, they're friendly with gotcha. each other. Oh, I guess you tried, but it's like all the friendlies want to be on my team for some reason. At least I got some help there, else that could have been pretty bad. So that's what I'm talking about. Now that I have help, I don't really die. I actually have a chance to do shit. But without help, that shit happens. Like, I don't mind people focusing me, but if I have help, it doesn't matter. Or at least, you know, kill me. I, I guess focus is a strong word. But the reason why a lot of people are focusing me is because I was the only one actually fighting. Like, that makes me an obvious target to go for. You just wanna fight, so you're going for me. But as an example, Rares officially wanted to focus me because he keeps going on the opposite team. Now we've got the spies going. Like, I don't even build a sentry here. You healed the spy. You die. I don't know what that sound is. Oh, is it... Is it this... Cave? I don't know. It must be something somewhere else. But, um, speaking of n not having a sentry, let's build a dispenser in here. And then build a sentry. Is it the water that makes that noise? It sounds like it's the water. No, it's not. Okay. Ah! 
So now we have like some cover. If we move this up a bit, of course. Yeah. Rares, let, let's get this straight. My sentry killed you, not me. You better, you better kill that sentry, man. You better kill it. But now I have a feeling that there are too many on blue that tries. Like, or, or not, or not. I must be looking wrong because... But you can see that, that people are fighting now and a bit better, so... It's just more interesting overall. Damn it. <laughs> it was interesting until I got zapped again. But, um, yeah. So, now we have a lot of friendlies as well in here, but... I mean that that's the thing right so we've been fighting a bit now it have been fun let's go hang out with the the friendlies for a bit yeah let's hang out with the friendlies for a bit uh, nothing much but uh, I don't know and that was for to the what's up my friend comment that that's nothing much up, I'm just, you know, streaming and... Um... I'm not sure what's going on anymore, but... Yeah, the server's full, sadly, I guess. But, uh, you can probably wait for a spot or something. Are you gonna build a... Yeah, you're gonna build a sentry, no thanks. Oh. Oh, you were gonna wrangle it. Uh, I don't know why people keep telling me their Steam names, I don't know what it... Uh, oh, I guess if, if you're playing in the game with me, then I can see when you kill me or something, because... You know... What is that noise? Oh, is that a... No, I thought it was like a secret area or some shit behind here. Because of the green light. I don't see the appeal for so many people to be friendly in here. But, um. Let's see if we can pick a fight. Damn it. Oh shit, I don't want to actually. Okay, we are going for it, even though if he gets a random crit, I would just be dead, and one of the most embarrassing deaths. I don't... If, is everybody f oh, 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 Pillow, that was rude. That was rude. Oh, that guy have an unusual gun as well. Uh, I've actually seen, like, a lot of people on this server right now having unusual guns. Like, I saw some medic with a, a cool medigun as well. That's something I look for, by the way. Other people are, like, looking at hats and shit. I look at weapons. <laughs> I don't know. I'm weird like that. So, are we just, you know, chilling? Or on fire, I guess. Oh, he tried to taunt kill me! He tried to taunt kill me. Oh, no, wait. <laughs> he tried to taunt with me. Whoops, whoops, sorry. He, he tried to taunt with me, not taunt kill me, because I did this. I don't even know what's going on anymore. It's like, this is this is when you read, this is what the old TF2 servers were like. Like this kind of bullshit happening. I miss it sometimes, but um, there's a lot of issues with community servers compared to the old TF2 servers, but I guess you just sometimes have to deal with that. Look at that. Usually, 
the situation where people stop being friendly is that some people start killing they trigger a chain reaction where everybody starts killing each other like that and uh, before with whatever happened so oh I have I have the perfect name for this stream by the way salty and angry stream that's gonna be the name for this stream or some shit at least gonna be containing salt as a word for a fact because there have been so much salt on this stream like unbearable much salt I'm legit just gonna change the title for now as well salty stream there we go because this is like a super solely stream. And then I'm actually gonna change it to salt and chill. There we go. We almost died while changing the title, okay. So I guess the fight have started again. The fighting have started again. I've played enough engineer, I believe, so, um, you know what, if we melee fight, why not do it as a medic, because that's usually how you melee fight, right? Oh, I guess not. I guess not, because then I don't have my pistol, so I can't deal with pillow. <laughs> uh. Um, yeah. Like, uh, I want some fight to happen. Not necessarily me, but I want to see other fight at least. And then join in if I get the chance. Oh, that was a spy. Didn't I hit him with like the random crit as well? No, I got hit by <laughs> random crits. Um, again, I call fight and blue doesn't get it. I actually have a lot of people who say my, that they are my biggest fan, and I really appreciate having so many biggest fans. It's like... A lot of people really like me, and I really appreciate that. I just don't know, like, can you even have a biggest fan? Because, okay, I guess you technically can, but then it's like to the extremes where it's like more stalker than anything. But other than that, saying that somebody's biggest fan just means that you really, really like them, I guess. Who killed me before with the random crits? Now we have a full uber. That's how you get a full uber. And for some reason a lot of people love me for my Danish accent or that I'm Danish. I don't know why exactly, but... <laughs> oh, it worked! Oh, damn it. I, I thought if I Ubered one of the friendly guys, he would kill somebody for using the Uber, but it didn't work. Oh, this is not what that demo wanna be doing. Never mind. Now imagine if we end up uber chaining with this medic. Oh yeah, it works. It works most of the time. Like make Uber somebody, make them kill for stuff. It's just why not? I need some Uber, so I'm just gonna take it there. And impressive that I didn't actually get backstabbed there. I I I legit didn't even look at him there at all, and I didn't get backstabbed. But every time when I'm looking at people, I get backstabbed. I don't know. That's the weirdness of stuff. 
Let's see. <laughs> I mean, I got the, the, the crit on one guy, and then I got stepped by the other. Let's go. Okay, now we're just being rude and spawn camping them, so I don't know. Let's watch for a while. Let's see what happens. I don't... Like, this is the thing where you can be a, You can be kind of a tryhard, but not really, because you want there to, like... You want it to be interesting. You want it to be... Interesting, so when your team spawn camp, you're just gonna watch for a bit. And that's what we're gonna do, even though I do wanna kill Pillow. I do wanna kill Pillow. I mean, killing him with his own nade works too. But that's what not spectating gets you. Um, I buy them one way or another, because I'm a collector. Uh, I also trade a bit, but that's... A lot of the time it's with stuff that I've bought that I no longer need or no longer want or just somehow, you know, got paid with overpay for or something. It's complicated like that, but let's just put the short end of it that a lot of my things I end up buying, yes, or... I've gotten a few unboxes, but that, then I've given those away, and then I've done a few, you know, where I buy on usulifiers and then I get something that I don't want, then I trade that thing, and then I use the things that I bought with to trade with, as an example, I just trade those things to something else and then I trade with that, like a loop in a, way, in a sense, I guess. I, I hope you get what I mean with that. Oh shit. Had a bit of lag spikes there by Lux. But yeah, I, I mostly get them by buying them and I keep up to date with the game and stuff and I also unbox a lot and then I tend to give away a lot of the things that I don't like to keep. Like, if I don't want to keep them or don't want to trade with them or don't have plans, I just, you know, give them away. Hey, Pillow. Gotcha. He's gonna hear that in a bit. What? Why was that not a backstab? I even hit him while he was dead winged. Oh, what the fuck? Like, I even hit him again, like, for another time on the back, well, he wasn't dead wing up. And... It didn't work out, but there we go. Just needed to be basically in the front of him, and then we backstab him. It's like, the other step was even like when he was set winger, but you'd still kill him with a back step then. But I didn't. So that's funny. Hey Pillow, I'm coming for ya. Oh, never mind. You would think that he almost had instant reaction to that, but we still got him. Uh, the fun, the reason why I do that is because I know he's watching the stream, so it's a bit funny that I kill him, and then a short while after he hears the like, Oh Pillow, I'm gonna get ya or some shit. Is it just me or is this very laggy? So, you know what counters a Deadwinger spy a lot? You backstab them. Because they can't Deadwing out of it. That's the logic there. Hey, I'm- Hey guys, do you wanna see how you get to hell? Because I can I can get to hell right now, probably. Or not, I can get I can get killed before I get the chance to go to hell, okay. Stole my knife too. But yeah, I, I, anyways, I hope that explains like the whole thing about unusual. I'm I'm starting to feel like I mean Pillow respected me and um, he he stopped like he, he have been helping me the whole stream ever uh, ever since I talked with him directly so I'm not gonna kill Pillow anymore I think I I've been too rude to him I'm done with with trying to kill him so 
I mean, even when medic, when everybody else was focusing me to help me, because he actually likes me, even though he, he also want to kill me. So... Not to mention, that person have killed me probably the most the whole stream. So, I don't know, why should I stop killing him? Or trying to? It's like, why? So about going to hell, like, what I wanted to do was just stab every single one, like chain stab them, get the biggest chain stab, but no. This is like a shooting range. Wait, 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 I just realized what we are on. I just realized what this map is. And then I get backstabbed. Then I get backstabbed because apparently I was being stalked. Yeah, okay. Um, I just realized what we have to do. Can you actually build a tele- no. Kinda hoped you would build a teleporter there. Can you build one in here? No. That seems like missed opportunities for teleporters. This map is very laggy for some reason, but I just realized that it's actually a control point or, you know, King of the Hill map, so we should probably be capping. <laughs> I mean, you can respect the map too much. Oh shit. I didn't want to kill Pillow anymore, but he leaves me with no other choice. He was attacking me, just defending myself. It's funny how a lot of people realize that there's a, con uh, or a control point to cap now as well. Because I mentioned it and started trying to cap it. There goes my sentry. So stuff is a bit funny like that. So we saw the spy, the question is just where? There. You can basically bottom knife me now. Yeah. I don't know what I took so much damage from. But it's funny how Rares are saying that I should stop killing him, yet he have killed me three times in a row now, for no apparent reason. Because I am killing him. Great logic, my friend. That's being hypocrite for you. Thanks for the ride. Like if you don't want somebody to kill you, then they don't kill them. Simple as that. Damn it. Ah, <laughs> uh, felt like it was gonna go good, but no. We still haven't kept the point, which is funny. Now we go with the sap. Um, the only way we can change the map is by capping the point. The map is already set to be changed. Somebody already wrote it on the map or some shit, so... That's why I realized that we should cap. I have an idea. Oh! Oh, I actually thought you could resupply that locket. I'm stupid. <laughs> I needed the mi- oh shit.
That's being a hypocrite for ya. I mean, I respect people, but you told me to stop killing you, and then you kill me about like, uh, oh, you kill me two times, and then you tell me to stop killing you. What? And then you kill me two more times for good measure. Like, what the fuck? I want that revenge. And you keep being invisible because you're no longer that ringer spy, you're just, you know, sneaking around. I don't know. Like... I'm not gonna show you any mercy anymore. Didn't get the revenge, so he's still alive. I like the spot I picked for my dispenser though. But yeah, let's let's actually, you know, try and deal with spices and of all things. No, I'm not even gonna do that. So where's Rares? I'm looking for him now, but that's that's a mistake because he's likely a spy, so he's looking for me. There you go. As I said, you don't even need to look for those spies, they come to you. Oh, that's nice that you're in the with me. I really appreciate having some bag off, especially against people who wanna, you know, kill you all the time. I see ya, you're such a spy. So what really matters is winning the round, right? Clearly. And um, there we go with the spying. Rip rares. I mean, you told me to stop killing you. I did your wish, even though you had just killed me twice. Then you killed me two more times with my own knife and dominate me. So, you know what? I think I, I'm just gonna enjoy killing you now because, you know, salty stream. I'm gonna be so salty about that shit now. Somebody make like some salt memes for me in chat. I do like this map. It's actually like I didn't like it for a moment because I realized I like I, I didn't think you could actually play the map, you know, that there wasn't that control point or shit. Then I realized, oh wait, there's a control point, and now suddenly this map is actually amazing. Aside from the uh, low frame rates for some reason. I don't know why I'm getting frame drops in this map, but it feels a bit such. And maybe all the details that are on the map which makes it so pretty as well, like look at this shit. Look at that background as well, it's like... Wow. The house is amazing. It's like there's even this backyard area as well where the point is. It's actually such an, a pleasing map to look at. Teleporter going up. Oh, that wasn't a spy. Are you a spy? Nope. Look at, look at all those, 
<laughs> Look at all those sentries. It's so bad. One demo will have like the biggest orgasm in history, killing this thing with like one detonation. But it's funny to look at. It's so funny to look at. Not even kidding. Uh, uh, I really appreciate that you like my videos and um, that I've cool. No, wait. You're insulting me. You're calling my unusuals cool. Haven't you seen the effect? It's called hot. This is hot. This is hot. Why you? Why you? Why are you insulting me with the word cool? <laughs> I'm just, you know, trying to be funny, but, you know, I get what you mean and I appreciate it, but it's still funny. What do you mean with... I, I don't, I don't understand your sentence. If you can ask me something and then what if I fit what do you mean with I fit? I, I, a sentence doesn't make sense for me. Man, my jokes are so cheesy. It's basically uncle jokes. I'm not even kidding. And people call Dane Uncle Dane. Oh, that, that's what he called himself, I guess. I'm such an uncle, though. Uh, I, I'm happy for anybody who subs as long as they like the stuff I make, so... I mean, it's really up to you if you enjoy it. I may stop the stream soon, and then... Nah, I don't even know if I'm gonna do another stream today. I may stream just for an extra hour, because I'm not gonna be streaming, like, uh, for the next f 14 days. Just because I'm gonna be on a crab internet. Oh, I'm happy that you got like 50 kills and 12 deaths. I think I got like the opposite. I think I got like 12 kills and 50 deaths. Not really, but I think I actually ended up getting a lot of kills because people actually heard my advice and started playing the game. Which was annoying because before, when I was the only one playing the game against the entire red team, it's like, yeah, that's not interesting to watch. I don't really get the friendly thing either because that's not interesting for the stream to watch, like, people being friendly for one hour or some shit, but... That, that's also why I'm trying to fight, you know. But then, nobody on my team wanna fight, so what the fuck? It's like you can't win. I can say your name, but I don't because I feel like it's cringy and I'm probably gonna mispronounce it. Oh shit. Oh shit. That's faster tower. I'm actually just gonna go off engineer. Because I remember how it went last time. Last two times because for some reason people like this map. Can I do like a vote? Yeah, we can actually vote a map. We can pick a proper map this time. I guess. Or at least uh, another map. I kinda liked Upward Abandoned. So we'll go. I'll try and make people go there. Holy shit with that card. Wow. I know, I know that I can change a new server, but... It's just that I have to change server in the middle of a stream and it always gets so wonky and... I don't know, are, are you running any, what is it called, scripts and shit there? Or not scripts, what is it called, like mods, like there's a lot of things to download plugins, that's the word. I know for a fact, like, if I someday get my own server, it's gonna be like a Zombie Fortress server for... 
Yeah, roll the dice. Uh, I I actually don't really like roll the dice that much. I mean, it's fun, especially if you're just playing for fun. But it's like then somebody gets caught, like, and they kill you, and they laugh at you, and then they're like, "Oh, you're trash." Um, if you got scammed for seventy keys, then I don't know how to help you. I mean. There's nothing really to do about being scammed, sadly. That's why there are so many people who want to prevent you being scammed at all costs. It's like Valve, Valve used to refund, like if you got scammed, but they don't do anymore because it have been abused. It's like you can't have nice things in life. I'm replying to you right now. That's like stream delay, sorry. It's like I have the stream delay at zero, but there's still like a few seconds of delay or like... Up to, I think it's some seconds, but there's sadly nothing you can do about being scammed. It sucks. I think everybody have been scammed and they learn not to be scammed again or stuff, but it's just such a stupid subject in general because uh, there's nothing you can do to it and they're just people who are, you know, scamming. It, it's just very hard subject to deal with. A lot of people make videos to like prevent scamming as well. Well, I'll give everybody free items. You can just enter my raffles when I make them, so... I mean, you get a chance at free items, but I'm not gonna give directly. If I give 70 key unusual to that person who is talking in chat, then I need to give that to everybody. And then it's like, I don't have that much money. It's like, that you legitimately have to give to everybody in the single world. But if I make it optional that you can enter a raffle, then it's something else, because then everybody in the world have the chance to, you know, get it, but, yeah. Mission begins in ten seconds. Build in the Five, four, three, two. Man, I really, again, like that this place is so open here. But, in any case, as I said, I can't do anything about you being scammed. Only you, yourself, can do something to prevent being scammed. And most of us have already been scammed once, if not more. That's just the nature of, you know, stuff. That's why scammers is the thing, because people are inexperienced and get scammed. At least nowadays, there are so many tools to help you not be scammed. There's even a warning when you try and trade. So it, there's just nothing to do. And it just sucks, to put it lightly. And I think that's the end of the subject. But yeah, now we are back at like playing it properly. Damn it. Yeah, I got outplayed there. Well played, whereas you actually outplayed me so hard there. I shouldn't have gone for my sentry so much. It's just you back away and then I try to go for it, but I don't know. Oh shit. Is that rare as I hear? Yes, it was rare as I heard. I could hear the cloak sound, I couldn't see him, and then that happened. Oh wait, you can actually go down there, that's amazing, there's a little boat as well. Oh my god, I need to check that out. That is amazing. Upward, but this map is actually slightly more interesting, basically. Wow. Like, I'm seeing so many changes that I just like. Like, proper like these changes. Damn it. Couldn't turn fast enough. Got the... I don't know, and then couldn't turn fast enough. Oh, there's even a water... Why? Th this map is so much better than Upward. 
Like the abandoned version. This is like there's explanation for everything and stuff actually makes sense and you're Let's not be stabbed again. Okay, at least he's not using the dead winger anymore, and that means a lot. The thing is, I keep thinking that Wes is using the dead winger, so I'm playing around the dead winger and not the cloak. So if he doesn't have the dead winger, he's not a problem. That's the only problem I see. Like, but then again, if I think he have a dead winger and he doesn't, then he's a problem. That's like the kind of thing. So, because then I'm. Not doing the right place. So we had to check something out, but first I want to check this thing out because this really speaks to me. Like this, this is amazing. Just the little room up here is amazing. This adds so much dynamic and depth to the map, in my opinion. I wanted to see this though. Yeah, this makes so much more sense in the water and everything. This map is so good. I I love this map. I don't know. It, the, this is one of my top five favorite maps now, even though it's not an official map. Wow. I just like it. It's so it's so satisfying and pleasing. I know that there's basically n nobody working on TF2, but. The thing is, Valve should actually just hire people specifically for TF2. Like, screw their uh, compassy politics and whatnot. Break them just so you can get more people for TF2. I love this map. I don't... It's like, I can't even make up my mind to put the sentry either. Oh, and the trees. Don't even get me started on the trees. They are amazing. I think you can even, if you don't fail, you can even jump into them. Nah, I, I need to rocket jump into them, I think, or go from someplace else. Well, run it on your server then, and then maybe next time we can try and figure out something, I don't know. No, no, listen. The thing is, the other games already have a lot of, or enough people, because everybody that they've hired are going over there, right? And then the argument that are being made for them not hiring more people for TF2 specifically is that everybody else will also have more people. But the thing they don't realize is how much money TF2 give them compared to how many people are working on them. And they should just accept that and then hire people equal to the amount of money that they make on the game. And not, you know, to the amount of money that they're spending on other bigger projects that are more interesting. They could hire people directly from the community as well. But they don't. They don't. Like, they could legit make an exception and hire people from the community. Missed all of those somehow. I don't know why they don't do it, but they could. They just don't. Damn it. It's like... It, it, it's legit like this. First off, all their projects and shit. They spend a lot of money developing that, right? TF2 is basically a project that doesn't need that much development to make insane amounts of money. If they put in the effort or just hired people directly from the community to work on the game, they would make so much money on the game. It's like insane compared to how much effort they're putting into it. I mean, heck, they just need to even hire people from the community who are already making stuff to them that they're making for free. I mean, they could legit. It's insane how much money that they can make without much effort actually like have some people from the community and then they also pick stuff from the community this is so amazing to look at though like have some people from the community that helps with the game and also goes in and picks stuff from the steam community oh I like that there's an opening there too as well like this opening makes so much sense as well I love this map every like 
all the design choices that are compared to the normal upward. I love it. Holy fuck, this map is genius. It's like, wow. It makes sense to me. There's so many places on, on like, upward where I'm like, this doesn't make sense. Here it does. Here it does. And it's just much more pleasing to look at as well. Overall. No, no, we're playing on... I'm, I'm... But I really love this map. Don't take this away from me. People took it away from me. This is why we can't have nice things. People take it away from you. Oh boy. Wait, what map did we even go to again? I don't really have lag, I think. And then I get backstabbed while fighting a scout, damn it. I can't pronounce that, I believe. But I'm just saying, there's so many design decisions, and like just for the better of the game, that they can easily hire people and justify it, if only they wanna screw the, like, compassy policies and whatnot, to make it happen. And they could make it happen. It's a bit like that scrap that map because it was like a s snowplow because it was too confusing for new players but then it wasn't and the maps that they already have are already too confusing for new players It's like what the fuck I don't want this map to end Can, can, there are like two spies on me again. There's the two spies on me again. Are you done? So here's the thing. If you are good heavy, you don't really get backstabbed unless you're firing on somebody else. So let's see if I get backstabbed. I got backstabbed, great! <laughs> yeah, I'm not play- I, I kinda need to play heavy though, but that's the problem. Or oh, I could go demo. I don't get why they have to take this map away from me though. Really loved it. Please what? What's popping Jimbo? I did a What like that? I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't even know what it means. You know, on other streamers, you'd have to pay for them to say that. Here you get that shit for free. Demo is a very fair and very, 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 very unbalanced class. I mean balanced class, we have to be sarcastic, right? 
I'm not even doing well. Oh. Well, I just screwed myself over then. Can Raz, can you like, can you go for other people please? I feel like I'm killing you so much now and um, I'm not really killing anybody else. But I'm killing a lot of people now. I mean that works, just got a Siggy Spam, you know. Just pick the Cancer class, play Cancerous. Stuff works out, apparently. I don't know about that, like... I know that I went demo now just to carry the game pretty much. And I think it works, because now I can just kill everybody because I have a medic on and I'm playing demo. I had kind of the wind up there where the random crit was, but I need to reload. Oh, <laughs> that that went well. That went well. Um, I think it's a workshop map. Yes. But it's a very nice map, like I really love this map, it already like is one of my top, like top 5 maps of all time now. It's so pleasing and so satisfying to look at. Hey, get wrecked pillow, I just melee fighted you there. <laughs> oh, that felt good, that felt so good. I, like, even here at the end, this makes sense. This looks nice. The other, like, hole didn't make sense, like, normally. Just gotta keep spamming, you know. That's like demos, like imagine if you didn't have to reload with demo, it would be so broken. But you ba basically don't because you have like a lot of clips still, that's why he's so strong. And does so much damage and can spam. Well, we got backstab there. We're not even doing that well, even though we are playing demo, just to like try and kill as many people as possible. But I mean, we're winning, at least. Oh shit. Damn it. I kinda got joggled back into the car, and then that killed me there. By the way, do you guys know that there's actually a Sunbeams Gibbous in existence, like an actual Gibbous? Somebody got it by, I, fi I think it was finding some kind of bug for Valve and then they got it granted back when you could get those. It's quite funny actually. I mean, I did something. Could probably have played better if I... I don't know. But yeah, like, just look. This map is so pleasing to look at overall. It's like, just look at that. 
It's such a, such a beautiful map. I love it. Why did people have to vote for another map? It's probably higher tower or fast tower or some shit again. Why do people want to play on that? Like, when we go to high tower or higher tower or whatever, everybody but the enemy team is friendly. And then I have to 1 versus 12, pretty much. And it's like, what's the fun in that? Yeah, I know you went mid for me. I really appreciate that. I don't think we would have won if you hadn't been a mid on me. But I think you also top scored, so I mean, you did fine. Oh, the good. That's even worse, isn't it? Because then it's like... I don't know. I can't use my unusual guns, that's why it's worse. So I have to play Dinia and Spy, because... Unusual weapons, right? I mean, gotta play with the style. Gotta play style. Freedom! You keep talking about your server, but I just have a feeling that going on your server will end up biting me in the ass at some point. I don't know. Then it's like everybody wants me to join their server. I don't know. I know you have unusual knife. You told me way back then, like before the some before twist event, where you also trick stabbed me with it. I think that was your first trick stab on me. And like I don't know how you still do it, and most of the time it's actually from the face you hit it. Valve should give me an unusual key. I'm not even kidding. I mean, I'm kind of an unboxing channel, and I've got all these unusual weapons, right? So I should totally like. Be granted an unusual key by Val. Makes sense to me. Oh shit. <laughs> maybe, may, may, maybe jumping down to six enemies was a bad idea. Damn it. Can we like quickly vote for another map because this round is gonna be over. Damn it. Oh wait, we've already selected the no oh yeah, we voted for last of us. That's why this is fun because The the thing that happened there is that everybody is attacking their team, which is actually silly that you can do that. Like they could add a kind of cleave to the melee weapon, so you hit everybody, but... And that would fix the issue of accidentally, like, getting your melee cancelled on allies because they're too close. Because that's a thing that can happen, where you can literally be invincible because they keep hitting each other instead of you. It's a bit silly, actually. I mean, three kills for being a Brent's engineer is pretty good, isn't it? Damn it. Kinda need the crits. <laughs> that, that engineer there. Makes me happy that you say that I'm a nice YouTuber. I just wish I was more popular. I don't know. It, it's not so much a selfish thing, it's more like... I guess it is, but let me explain first. I really just want to entertain more people and, you know, actually become a proper... What you could call maybe a symbol or some shit, like... Be able to do some good stuff, you know. Make people happy, entertain a lot of people, and actually be known, and help out where I can, but... It, it's just... I don't know, I, I just wish that is it. But then, you can look at it in a way that... 
well, why do I want to help people? And it's like, I don't know. It, it's just I really like helping people and it makes me happy to help others. Uh, especially, like, especially when I'm not having any issues myself and like have an open heart to be able to help others. But then it's like, isn't that a bit selfish? If it were another thing than like being nice to others, then it would qualify as being selfish. But in this case, it doesn't. But it's like, isn't that a bit odd? How it can be selfish to want to help others? Like, just think about it for a bit. Just the idea of that is silly, but when I put it the way I do, it makes sense. Uh, I, I I don't know about no troll videos. I mean, you, you could call the 1000 degree knife video a troll video, but I do a lot of, like, I don't know, Not probably not for you, but I have a lot of various, it's more like a meme video, I guess, but I make a lot of various shit. And a lot of the things are just like one time shit or a few times shit and then the things I make the most is like gameplay and uh, unboxing, I believe. And then a lot of other few things that I do a lot of, I guess. But it's mostly just gameplay and unboxing. Maybe showcases, I guess showcases count because every time I have something I uh, showcase it I guess so. Yeah, I guess. Also, another thing is, I think my voice is annoying, and I don't get why so many people like it, but I guess I actually have a nice voice then. Um, I don't add people, you can feel free to join my Steam group, that's like my YouTube friend list, because there's a limit on people that you can have on your friend list, but there isn't a limit on people you can have in your Steam group. Also, if you're in the Steam group, you'll be notified about, like, raffles and stuff like that, so, I mean... That's nice, and I also think I'll start announcing like the event wise thing with streams so people can. Can we not go to the shit maps anymore? I, I liked the good a lot. It was one of the maps that I really liked first, but then it's like now I have unusual weapons, so it's a shit map by default because I can't use unusual weapons, right? Doesn't that make some sort of sense? It's like why have unusual weapons if you can't use them? Like, does it make sense for me to play the good keep? But I don't know. I mean, the only reason I used to be good with Huntsman was because I played a lot of the good keep, but now I don't anymore, so... I've also been pretty crap with the Huntsman every time I've tried it lately. I should have hit more than that, but whatever. Got him, that's all that matters there. Oh shit, I almost fell down there. Okay, he got the crits now, so no thank you. Just gonna get some ammo so I can air blast. We have a lot of control points. I heard that. So now we have another issue where I see a lot of blue people doing well, but barely any red people doing well. Are you kidding me? Even with like the pocket medic now. Kinda need that health, but never mind. Never mind me. Can't believe I survived that shit though. No, 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 no. I had a feeling that that spy was around. I, he could have revolved on me. There he is, so. You shouldn't panic when fighting pyros, that's like the mistake a lot of people makes. Especially if you're a revolver spy, you can just kill him. But 
if you go in a panic and start missing your shots and then you go in a more panic, then you won't hit him even though you only have like 20 HP. And also the inaccuracy thing is really something you need to keep in mind with the revolvers. If you wanna join the game, there's uh, IP in the description. We're still going for like half an hour, I believe. Oh shit. Can't do much against an Uber. Especially not when he gives it to the targets that I'm trying to kill. And then switches it around when I switch target. <laughs> Let's just, I, I mean, I saw a lot of people just stacked up there and being dominant. So let's see if we can make that funny. Scram the teams. Why haven't that been voted like forever ago, but whatever. Splash. Well, I didn't even need to change the demo there, that was just unnecessary. I'm not even playing that well in general. No, I only got like 7 gills there, I don't even... What was I doing this whole game? I don't even know. I guess I was a bit pyro trying to outlast some people off the cliff, but it didn't work out, and then I got backstabbed or uh, no, killed by Spy a few times, I guess. Still a bit annoying that every time we go to a new map, somebody votes for another map, so we always change maps, but... I mean, that's fine in a way, but it's just when the maps are trash. Or some of those maps we get to a trash, then it's not so fine. But uh, wasn't this like the western like map with the? No, that's a payload race. Oh yeah, this is this is the one with the tanks at the bay. Yeah, I get it. I get it. The one where you have to push the tank and then it get launched every time you cab it. This is the map, like if you were here earlier, where I basically got three men by three ambassador spies. I don't know what misc you should buy a two key, but you should try and look for what what misc you like the most, and probably buy that. And if you can't afford it, it's maybe a good idea to save up for it. You don't need to spend keys as soon as you have them. Like I have above hundred keys in my inventory right now, just. Either gonna be going for uh, to a golden pan, or if something else I wanna buy suddenly appears. Three, two, one. Why the Groot keep? Are you kidding me? We just got a new map, and you'll all like already back to the Groot keep. So I can't wait. No, this is another map. This map actually looks nice again. So many nice maps, yet people have to be trolls and go to maps where I can't use my weapons. Which is nice, I guess. Don't melee me. If that, if today's lesson, it is, do not melee Archimo. I think that's today's lesson. Well, this is interesting. Again, do not melee me. Don't 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 go melee. I look like a spy. Oh, it wasn't. Okay, a surprise. Man, this map is also very interesting. Like, gotta say that. I hear a train, but where? Just gonna put down the sentry here.
Like, I, I, I think there's a train on this map, but I'm not sure where. Oh, up there, I guess. Oh. <laughs> That's funny. But no, I, I don't get why a lot of people want to vote on the Groot, and then as soon as we're on the Groot, they want to change map again, just to change it back to the Groot. Like, that doesn't make sense. But yeah, that is something that looks funny. Man, this map is just getting better and better. There's even a train! Look at that! I missed the crit there. I had the crit, but I backed away and missed it. Great. But this map just keeps getting better and better. Like, you look at the down floor layer, and it's just... Oh, this is one of the best, better maps. And then... You just see... Oh, there's another floor! And there's another floor! And there's a train! Is that the train? I think that's the train. Yeah, there we go with the train. It's... Such a nice map. I don't really wanna get driven down though, but... I just saved that scout. Man, I wish we could get some of these maps into actual TF2. Maybe with the jungle update we get some of these style of maps that look really, like, pleasing to the eye. Who knows? There goes my sentry. Building the sentry. sentry Is that guy trying to market garden? Not on my watch. Just saving the poor NGs. You gotta save the NGs. Damn it. I should probably not have expected that the sentry kept shooting when I ran closer. Like, shooting the direction it was. I just assumed that if I charged it, I could probably get it. Oh, you can even... you can even... Wow. That's nice. <laughs> it's so sad that he would actually not even have burned out there with the damage I managed to do. But he was still running for the water to get, like, the fire put out. I'm just gonna abuse this dispenser a bit. You know what? This is a uh, rancher relaxing engineer you can respect because he's actually doing something by building a dis dispenser, you know. I, I don't know if he was friendly. I mean, normally you have your melee out if you're friendly, not your ranged weapon. So, I mean, that could really mean anything, though. Yeah, you know what? This is why we used the pistol. And still not even getting the kill, okay. Damn it. So something you need to also know is that engineer skill, a lot of it is, is actually knowing the map. I don't know, that may have something to do why, why I also like engineer a lot, because it's like the maps and then learning them and it, it's just so interesting to get like the spots and stuff and where the metal is and I don't know. Probably a bit nerdy but it's still like so nice to, like you are on a bad ground but it feels like you're, you're playing a new game sometimes when you get a new map as an engineer to get and explore it, it's so good. Oh, so now you join my team to beat me on score. You do know Spice is 
more points on backstab. The only way I actually, you know, beat you is by tryharding and put down a teleporter. Because that's like my way to keep up with score. Spice way is to get like double point on backstab. And the nearest is teleporters. Then you have snipers who get bonus points on headshot. But I haven't built, uh, I don't, I think I've built like a few teleporters. The stream, but not really that much. And they usually get zapped because the enemy team have like, what, three spies most of the day at average. So I don't really want to bother with the teleporter. Mission begins in 10 seconds. So uh, I'm just gonna take a random team, I guess. Five, four, three, two, one. Let's uh, save some people. I know it was a joke, but I'm still saying, you know. Um, sleep well then, if you're going to bed, I guess. I don't really know what else to say there. I mean, I killed somebody and made them like electrify, but then I still got killed. So. Why do we like? Why do we have to play in the group? Like, why? This is basically bad to use because of not being able to use the Javare. Damn it. But it's like, is this what people want to do? Because they keep going to the Groot Keep and Blue always wins instantly. It's like, why? Why even bother at that point? Why, why are we always going to the Groot? Oh, there's some... I didn't even get to, to vote, but whatever. I just don't get why so many people also accept the, the good one. And then accept to go onto a new map if they already accepted the good. Like, doesn't make sense. Guess we got backstabbed. <laughs> you, sh you should like... I, I know you just said like it was a joke with the... With like mentioning yourself keeps beating me, right? But you should be like... When you stabbed me there, you should have been like, w just a prank, bro. It fit so well in the, like, context we were talking in. Damn it. But then, like, you, you quickly see that I'm always on the worst team for some reason, or a lot of the time today. Because... Right now, when they were on the blue team, they just capped instantly. And, um... When I'm on the blue team, they're spawn camming us. Even though I'm killing a lot of people with the Huntsman, which is... I'm actually very impressed that I'm even landing these shots at all. Because usually, when I go Huntsman, it just goes terrible, but... I used to be very good with it. I keep thinking the sniper that I shot up there is still a threat. Oh. Wish I had an unusual huntsman though. <laughs> Imagine, hot. Y you don't know if it's actually on fire by a pyro or if it's unusual. Oh. I guess real men actually makes the unusual weapon unusual like this. I like won't know the difference. Again, it's a very bad idea that I'm using this of all weapons. 
just generally speaking. Because I take more damage while having it out and it can't quit unless I have the Dirade. But I'm just too lazy to change my set, honestly. Standing around like, <laughs> standing around like Ugh! I wanna see what a Ugh! looks like when they're standing around. Anybody else wanna see that? Just sounded so funny. Reminds me a bit of like the memes with Overwatch that I've seen a bit of even though I'm not into Overwatch at all. But it's like they use the ultimate and they always send like Ugh! because they die. Look, Tf2 had that first. It's actually not an Overwatch thing. That's another thing stolen from Tf2. Like saying stuff and then dying and doing the Urk. We're just gonna be aiming down here, it usually gets somebody, eventually. Or, or get you, if you're standing there, which is why you don't stand there. But you can see how hard it have been for like blue, like our time is almost up in general. And we're like fighting for, uh, like, so hard. But when they were on blue, they just went pretty much pop rushing in. Or pop something, I mean. Damn it. But yeah. We actually have to be on B as well, or we lose. Yeah, there we go. I it's like that A got capped. We would have had overtime, but if the B was also on the cap, then it, you know, that it would say overtime, then the gate would open, and then it would also be overtime until it closes again. But yeah, red was just way better again. It's like always the team I'm not on. I'm not even doing that well today. I'm like playing like trash, and I can't play my main because then I get like two direct hit soldiers up my ass. I don't know. Why would I pick his team to win? I don't really care anyways, I just don't think the, the teams are balanced at all ever. I don't mind trying to carry a team, it's just annoying when people then go direct hit soldiers or whatever. But here we are on a payload, and I get payload, so let's do this. And I know the map, so... I kinda wanna be red because I wanna be engineer. And engineer is always better on red. But I could go blue engineer as well, so I guess I'll go blue engineer. Oh, that's a short form of your name, I see. I didn't even go for that, I, I just got the joke now. I thought there was actually a guy called Retro, not... You know, what you're called in-game, which is like, Retro... Like, Red Rogue, as in a rogue that's... Red, I, I don't know. Look, this is why I don't do with names, because it's so cringy with others' names. That's also why I'm like okay with everybody butchering my name, like not calling me Akimo, they're calling me Akimo, they're calling me... Uh, like a guy recently called me Arkham Asylum for some reason, where I'm like, what the fuck, I'm not that crazy. Just because he couldn't read my name, it's like, my name gets butchered a lot. And that's why I find it cringy, so I just am welcome with that, and then I don't try to like... Say others' names. Yeah. You wanna know what your name means to me? It means, like, Red is a Retribution Paladin in World of Warcraft, and then Rogue is a Rogue, so you're basically a Retribution Rogue from World of Warcraft that doesn't exist because it's a spec combined with a class.
Let's get our sentry here and then aim a bit at that pyro. Is that pyro just tossing flares at my sentry right now? Is that uh, a thing that's happening? I'll just take out the mini. Damn it, somebody stole my mini sentry kill. I mean, that was clearly mine. And then uh, I just did one more bullet on it, and then the worker hit. Rip Enzi. Rip everybody. I don't want to scram the teams, I'm finally doing well on a more decent team by looks. Okay, we're gonna destroy the sentry and now we have some crits. And we can use those crits to snipe the heavy like a boss. I kinda need the metal, but I guess not. I love being like uh, basically a spy in this situation. Pretty much a spy in the ninja near without the teleporter trick. Rip that in. Oh shit. Rip me. That's a mini. Well, shit. I'm still not even close to doing well. I guess I'll have to build a teleporter. So I can get a feeling that I'm actually doing stuff. Oh, I was on fire, whatever. Who gives a damn? Okay, I guess there was the health pack there. It would have been nice if there were, so it would actually make sense with what I said. He's gonna kill that, give me the crits, and um, that was my thought process there. That's why I charged the heavy, like an idiot, because I knew that I was gonna get crits. We're not even stomping them that hard, I mean, we aren't capping yet. I actually like being able to kill heavies with my pistol. Okay, can we not talk about this chat, please? Do please don't talk about this, we... No. I didn't see the train. I forgot to put down a teleporter again. Okay. I I don't know where I want to put my teleporter though. I think I'll just put it here actually. Oh shit, that's directed for ya! That's what I said, as soon as I play Engineer with my viewers, people are gonna go directed just to... pain me, you know, pain of my life, the directed.
Like, as an engineer male, I'm like, can that thing just only do the extra damage to buildings? It's like, that would make sense. You, you get so many upsides with it, especially if you hit your shots a lot. Especially with the extra speed and have a built-in mini crit, so when you launch people into the air, you, you get it, but... But even so, like, even if it were just a counter to buildings and not really, you know, extra damage always, then... I mean... At least I could then fight a direct hit soldier. Like, without being one-shot. Because being one-shot is a bit bullshit, in my opinion. That, or Engineer could have like 150 HP at the fall. That would work too. I actually hope they do that. Like, they buff the spice movement speed. Why can't Engineer? Like, he's a tough guy. He's at least as tough as the Medic. So at least give him 150 HP. Seriously, I mean, come on. Engineer isn't that strong of a class anyways. And... If they want to move more focus over to individual skill, they can give the Engineer more life to work with at, like, the fall. At least that's what I'm thinking. I could have been doing down by the train again there, couldn't I? I guess we are kind of stomping them a bit now, which is kind of rude. <laughs> uh, speaking of one-shotting people. Am I right? But I mean that's crits that I earned. Because against good players, you won't get the sentry kills. Like nobody really dies to a sentry if they are good. Unless, or like with a team that is. Like good with a team. And like they're, they're praying, uh, like, you know, coordinating and shit. Max one guy is gonna die to the sentry or everybody's gonna be overhealed as well because you have a medic then. And then nobody dies to the sentry, you don't get the crits and um... Or if you do, you have like helped the sentry or some shit, or your team have been there, and then you've earned them. But in props, you, you more like give them for free, I guess, so it's a bit rude as well, like that. I think we will play this round and then I think we'll stop the stream, because we've been streaming for like four hours. So I don't really mind with the map either. Just gonna be middle efficient here, even though I don't know by how much exactly. I mean, by now, the big ammo pack here would have respawned, so I don't really know if that was middle efficient at all. Mission begins in 10 seconds. Yeah, I, I missed the last hit there, whatever. Just gonna grab this. And then we've got the sentry. Wow, that end just got like raped in a corner there. Like, n no reasoning about that. That was just what happened. Like, two people going at him in a corner. I mean, this is probably not the best sentry location, but it's doing stuff. I think we'll have to retreat a bit. Yeah, I'm not gonna... not gonna do with that anymore. I'm just moving back here. Oh shit, that was a mistake, okay. Why did that not kill him? Damn it, why did that kill him? I mean, I had the aim correct, and then the bullet spread is just like, oh, you hit three crits, well, fuck you, he still have like 100 HP left. And uh, hi to new person riding in chat.
Spencer. Packing up. We're just gonna build the sentry here now. Oh shit. Yeah, we are dead. I mean, you don't even need a direct hit to hard count an engineer, as I said. It's just... But then you had the direct hit if, if it didn't do the extra damage to players. I really think that's what they should do to that weapon. Okay, they have two snipers apparently as the in-game chat is telling me, so we should probably be careful with that. Uh, not doing too bad, but not well either. That's how to not die in melee combat, I guess. And that's how to die in melee combat, apparently. Got him. Dispenser going up. <laughs> he destroyed the dispenser with this melee, wow. Okay. Okay. Gonna get this upgraded. Are you a spy? You look like a spy. You look like a spy. Oh, you're not a spy. Okay. You should just jump down here instead of dying, because we have the sentries here. It would have been safer to jump down. Moving out. That there wasn't getting any lighter. So I think those snipers are being a bit rude. Just a bit. At least you can't. At least they can't peek. I mean, from this direction there, without being uh, pushed down by the sentry. We like. Oh. So. Man, people are just dying around us. Oh, that was a spy, okay. I mean, we do have all the sentries around, so probably not a good idea for that spy. I mean, the only uncle thing about me is my jokes or puns, because that's uncle things, I guess. What you would call that. Or dad jokes, or I don't even know. But maybe I'm making too much fun of myself. Okay, my sentry is getting zapped, whatever. That means I just can't. Dis there we go. That's what I wanted to do until my sentry got zapped. And I had to improvise. Oh well. Well that worked out fine and I think this is a good place to stop the stream. We are actually pretty much exactly 4 hours in so I hope you guys enjoyed this and as I said won't be able to stream for like the next 14 days because I'm gonna basically take care of my parents house and their dog while they are like off holiday or some shit I don't know. But that, that's gonna be like 14 days so you know, won't be able to stream there, and yes, I'm done, I, like, four hours streaming, I think this is, like, on par with my uh, Zombie Fortress stream, and my voice is totally butchered as well, I can't even feel the pain anymore, 
like that that's how much I've butchered my voice today so again hope you guys have enjoyed this and uh, I'll see you again next stream or next video whatever you watch